Yo, I'm so sorry I'm late. I promise I didn't mean to actually be late this time. What's what is going on, everybody? We are here. We are back for some more Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, the Indigo Disc DLC. I'm so sorry I'm late. <clears throat> I had to wolf down some food because I just recorded with Dylan. Um, but we're here. We're here. We we have we have our boys. We got our we got our team, and we also got. Daquan out here with the huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You like that? Maybe I should just custom, custom voice all of my notifications. Boys, boys and girls, everything in between, everyone in between. We are here to play some more of this DLC. I'm hoping actually today I'll get through <laughs> the whole thing. <laughs> That's my goal at least. I have no idea how it's gonna go, but we're gonna we're gonna do our best. I'm absolutely blistered right now. I just recorded. Uh, I didn't wake up till 2 p.m. Um, and I'm absolutely knackered. So, hi Chris. Hi, what's up? Hope you're having a good day. Is it out now? Yeah, 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 yeah. Did I have a good sleep? I don't know if I could say I had a good sleep. I uh, woke up and I felt like I I just had raised, and I woke on a different planet. You know what I mean? <laughs> What am I saying? Uh, Adam in love with the SP uh, membership. Thank you very much. And Christina as well. Thank you for the gifted. I do appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I think I can have this like this. It's this one I need down. Oh. All right, listen. Let me give you a rundown real fast, right? In the back burner, we've got... We've got our Kingdra, who is still, I think, part of the team. But we also picked up Hydrapple. A very cool Pokemon, indeed. Um, we need to give it a nickname. Uh, I think it's a nickname it yesterday. And I don't think anybody has the Applin line claimed on, on here, right? God, I don't know. Have I got anything on my face? But he is super sick. He is super, super duper sick. Uh, and since we just, like, I mean, Christina's the only one. It's a girl, too. I'm gonna get to Christina. Thank you for opening up the stream with a gifted. I do appreciate you. Thank you very much. Christina. I want to see, how does he walk? <laughs> how does he walk? Can I just, can I just, can you just, give me a favor. <laughs> Look at me, dude, boy, boy. Go, boy, boy. Go boy boy, come here, come here, boing, 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 boing. <laughs> Little girl. <laughs> right, listen, we got three. We got three of these um Elite Four members to kick ass, right? Um, and they're all double battles. Who was I who was I gonna lead with? This is a um we gotta do a trial. And it's a fairy gym. So we definitely want steel types out, right? Um I think I honestly think Randy and BD would be a good choice for this. But let's just get it going, right? Let's just let's just get this ball rolling for sure. Welcome to Coastal Plaza. The team supposed to miss Lacey, the Elite Four. Well, how much BP is it gonna cost me to do this? 50. Okay. Cool. I'm actually gonna have fun grinding this BP, I think, you know. Sick. Duly received and noted. Miss Lacey! This is our homie. Oh, if it isn't Lukey, I'm so glad you decided to pay me a visit. Please follow me. I'll show you to the trial site. Let's get it. We out here now. No, I haven't done the synchronized quest yet. I think it's a side thing, right? I want to get the main story done because Twitter is filled with spoilers right now. I keep opening the app and it's... Get out of my face. You know what I mean? Thank you for coming to the Coastal Plaza to challenge me. And I'm really sorry for the way I protested you joined the BB League, Lukey. Of course, it's true that it is, uh, this is quite irregular under the bylaws of our school clubs, but mainly I didn't want you to get dragged into the drama that's been troubling the club lately. Oh, she's looking out for us. I suppose our trial has already officially begun though, so let's get it, uh, get to it and have some fun. The trial I came up with was this, a Pokemon quiz. All right, listen, I'm like the brainiest Pokemon YouTuber. I'll ask you five questions about Pokemon, if you can answer more correctly in your past. I'm gamer, let's do this. I'm the best at Pokemon ever. Are you ready to step up? Yes, get you with it. Don't help me chat, I can do this. Great, I'll just get everything ready then. Yeah, go on. I'm the best. <gasps> it's a Pikachu. Yes, Pokedex number 25, electric type. First uh, introduced, Pokemon red and blue, red and green. 
Pikachu here to help. And with that, question one. Pikachu is an electric type Pokemon well known for producing electricity within its body. Correct. Which part of his body is this? Come on, man. You're gonna give me baby. Hey, stop moving, buddy. Yes, the cheeks. Come on, man. Who do you think I am? Who do you think I am, bro? Look at me dancing. Look at him. <laughs> yes. Now then. I think we're ready to move on to the next quiz question. Okay, Venonet. It's bigger than you think it would be, but it's so fluffy and squeezable and terribly adorable, really. Question two. On the darkest of night, Venonet is able to use a certain part of his body. <sighs> Well, well, well. What's up, Aiden? Okay, you next to the membership. All right, come on. Come on now. Come on, man. I did this back in 2004. Oh, well, there's eyes. All right, next one. Can you it? Bring out a Mewtwo or something. How crazy would that be? Ooh, oh, is it going to ask which, which is the mark? Seems like they uh, live in precious antique teacups. There's a lot of phonies out there. It's hard to tell which cups are actually genuine. Ooh, that's actually a tough one. One of the Sinistee is an antique form. Which Sinistee has the real deal? All right, so we've got to wait for them to flip upside down, right? Because the mark is underneath them. Okay, so wait. It's the middle one. Aha! See? The DLC is fine, man. I'm loving it. But it doesn't matter which, yeah, they're all darn cute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, give me, give me the next one. Give me the next one. I actually could be quite difficult for a newbie. <gasps> oh, my baby boy! Look at him! Oh, he looks so good in this game. Look at the pink. All <gasps> oh, the colors. Uh, oh, we'll keep it on the pink one. Looks like a Mario Party mini game. Oh, this is cute. Okay, it's the right one. It's the right one. He's here. Breakthrough. Yeah! He's pogging. Oh, he's so cute. Ding ding, you did it. Even after they returned to their meteor form, he still managed to find the right one. I love, he's so good. <laughs> I love Meteor so much. Oh, Gramble. He's ready to square up. Maybe I heard the word pink and decided to stop by. This little sweet is one of my own Pokemon. It's always with me. Oh, he looks so good actually though. His, his, his model update really, they, they did a good job. They did a really good job. But can you tell me this? When I take a nap, my adorable Gramble, which part of his body do I use as a pillow? Uh-oh. Um, surely his belly, right? In belly? In belly? In tummy. Yes. Yes, of course, of course. Want to cuddle up to it? Something cozy? I fall asleep in just seconds. And that's the end of my quiz. Easy. Let's go! Easy! Easy, I'm a Pokemon master, boy! Why don't we head back to the plaza? Yeah, we can do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, guys, listen. Is the stream lagging? No, yeah, give it, give you give your stream a, a refresh. Or bring down the quality option. You go down to 1080p. All right, double battle, baby. Let's see how this goes. Let's see if I—I uh, I don't want to get rinsed three times on the stream again because it's frankly it's kind of embarrassing. Um, I open, the, open the envelope. I have not opened the box yet. No, I haven't opened it yet, guys. It's been—it's been mad since this DLC came out. Honestly, I'm still a bit shocked. But I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of our battle. She really doesn't want me here, man. Disrespectful. Christy, thanks for the gift, dude. I appreciate you. Thank you. First of all, I should tell you I only use fairy type Pokemon. There's nothing like an adorable pink fairy, right? No, weak to poison and steel. Anything caustic or cutting just doesn't suit them. Oh, but you know this already, right, Luki? Now, for this battle, I'm not going to hold anything back. What oh, the music. I forgot the music was that. I'm a big sucker for like EDM, like 90s, like boop, 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 boop. You know that, that, that sound? It's my vibe, man. Let's get it. Thanks, Alex. All right, Lacey, let's get it. She has nest balls. All right, she's now a Gramble, and why am I so far away? <laughs> right, okay, this is good for us. This is great. 
my usual party as a member of the Elite Force. We've got an intermediate it's fire. We're both special attackers. I'm vibing with this. Whimsicott Prankster is my only concern here. I might get powdered or, or something. Uh, so I'm going to flash cannon the Gramble, and then I can just straight up Ice Beam Whimsicott. Or... I kind of want to get a bit saucy with it. I might Terra Tri- I might Terra Tri Attack. Turn one Terra, baby. No fear. No fear for me. Hey. Hey. Oh. Oh. Nice one. Who's that next in 10 months? Oh, the light screen. Wow. Okay, he definitely lives a Tri Attack. Let's see how much this does. I'm actually interested to see how much does. Toy Specs? That's with, with the light screen up, by the way. This definitely survives now, right? Damn, it didn't even... Oh, the crit. Okay, I don't know if crit mattered, but damn. What does she mean by that? What do you mean by that? Mars, let's stay seven months, bro. I just land that kind of hit. No, that's just not right. What's up, Randy? The music, the music slaps, bro. Free Marina! She's back! Okay, 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 okay. I can Thunderbolt Free Marina. Let's uh, get rid of this Whimsicott. Is it going to reflect? No, okay. Okay, no Prankster. I think it was going for an attack, so I'll just get rid of this. Bye-bye. I don't really want you annoying us anymore, but I'm pretty sure she's going to be light clayed up. That's going to last for a while. I don't think this does. Did you do half? Damn, it doesn't do half. Moonblast, uh, we, we tank this. We don't. Wow. Even with my AV? Is she specs? Oh, Galarian slow, bro. That's interesting. Um, You know, chat, have you noticed they don't tell you the type effect of this on screen? It doesn't tell you which is super effective. I don't know if it's because it's a double battle or not, but... Okay, so Galarian is poison and psychic, right? Do we double the slow bro? Or do we double the Primarina? I think we should double Primarina. Let's double the Primarina. Oh, we don't have our decks yet. That's right. Good point. Good point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We haven't finished our decks. That's right. All right, cool. Doubling in is definitely the way we can melt something. And then all we got to do is wait for this slow bro to throw something. Yeah, I forgot you need a complete deck. Oh, the flamethrower, we tank that. Yeah, yeah, easy. That burn isn't too big a deal. And the stamina buff. I think it's just fairy Pokemon. She brought the Galarian Slowbro to counter some of her weaknesses. Just not the weaknesses I have. Oh, Al Creamy. Okay. To be honest with you, I'm not really scared of the Slowbro. I think we can just keep Slowbro chilling. And we can just drop it on Al Creamy. Is it throat spray Primarina? She's Moonblast on me. She's use fucking Aria, so. So, this is 29 months. It's insane how much damage that does, considering the light screen is up. That's pretty nuts. Shell Sidearm? Yeah, he finally realized that the uh, Porygon is definitely the problem here. <laughs> For sure. You also know Slowbro is super slow, right? Oh, she has an Excadrill! He's gonna make it fairy. She's gonna make it fairy, right? So he is quite fast. Okay, I'm gonna flash cannon the extra drill and I'm gonna try attack it because she's gonna tear a fairy. Quick draw. Surely she does. Go on, do it. I love the animations of the Terrastal. Yeah, there it is. Yes, sir. I knew it. Of course, of course. They always use that typing. I love that she uses the extra drill, though. Let's see. So we have our Ice Beam. I think I this. I don't. Okay. That's fine. We got so much. We got so many resources behind us now. I don't think the screen. I think the screens are still up, aren't they? They must be. There's no way you'd live that otherwise. High horsepower, can you take that? No, sir. Oh, dear. Oregon did some damage, though, considering the light screens up the entire game. And I had two special attackers out. There it is. And that wears off. There it goes. Right. Okay. Let's get, um, 
We can't bring out a fairy type. That's not. Uh, sorry, I'll probably beat the fairy. Let's bring you out. And we'll bring JJ out as well. Okay, let's get this. Let's get this uh, escadrille done. Uh, I say we beak blast the slow bro. Actually, no. Let's just beak blast the escadrille just in case we don't kill it. And then we can just go for we can go for thunder punch. Quick draw pops again. How many times are you gonna have quick quick draw proc? Psychic? Okay, we can take psychic. We can take a psychic. We can't take two though. I'll tell you now. <gasps> He's fast. Oh my god! What the heck? This gags are just quick, man. Is he scarfed? There's no way, right? I right, see two cannon, baby. I love two cannon. I love two cannon, bro. He's sick. Beat blast just went hard. He picked up the kill. Hey, you know what? It's time, I'm gonna BM now. Oh my god, this is a bug. That's absolutely a bug. I'm BMing right now. Christina. Hello. Uh uh uh. Alright, let's see if we can get that. Let's get a fickle beam on deck. Give me the fickle beam. Don't don't quick draw. No poison moves, please. Wait, yeah, we got it. Yes. <laughs> it's a one hit KO! Damn! Yes, sir! Oh my god, chat, you know, it doubles the power. It goes from 80 to 160. My word, that is crazy. Oh god. You're the cutest, Lacey! No, eh, wrong. <laughs> you both were very well as, uh, very cute as well, Luki. You know, it's not just going, uh, it's just not right for the two people to hoggle the cuteness between them. Why don't we wrangle up the cute Pokemon here uh, for a cute picture we can share with everybody? Oh, what? The mini -or! That's so good, bro. That's so good. So good. Well, this one's just too cute. I'm going to make myself a backup copy or three. Right, cool. So what's the TM? Give me the TM. Give me the TM. So we got Disarming Voice. What's the other one we had? I swear there's another voice, right? I I, I just... I, I dismissed the message too quickly. Let's have a look. Let me see, alluring voice, it's a disarming voice. Is that, is that, is that only an echo voice and stuff like that, right? Yo, champ in the making. This is so throwback when he says that. Echo voice, true, true, true. So there's two, um, let's do elite four members down already. You sure are crushing it. I'm glad I did Drayton first. And it's all about cuteness and that's what helps her make her Pokemon stronger. She's so into her team training, a little cuties doesn't even feel like a work, uh, feel like work to her, right? Wild, right? I bet it's the same for you, huh? You work so hard at it because you like it. Unlike a certain someone who seems busy run, uh, running himself and everyone around him into the ground just to get a bit stronger. You know, Lacey's polite to everyone else, but she's really blunt to me. I wonder why. She got a thing for you, bro. Trust. Oh, here's... Oh. Oh. Hey, Karen. Seems like things are going well with the VB League. Right, Luki? What's up, mighty champion? Scoping out the competition? I was getting worried. It'd be so disappointing if Luki had gotten weaker. Oh my god, that smile is creepy, dude. But you seem uh, as strong as ever, thankfully. Luki, go all the way. Don't go losing. It seems so, 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 like, nice, but you know deep down he's, like, you know what I mean? I know, uh, I can't show you how strong I've gotten if you don't even make it to me. Yeah, someone's good and riled up. Anyway, you got places to be, right? I better not keep you. See ya. Good luck with the remaining Elite 2. Mm, Higarashi vibes, bro. I'm telling you. Tell me. If you've seen a Higarashi, you know. I kind of want to use Ogre Pond against him just for BM, but it's already level 100. Is there going to be two over level? I, I, I might bring it in and switch out straight away just to see what would happen. AZ, thanks for the, uh, thanks for the uh, membership, bro. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, okay, let's look at the TM real fast. We just got Alluring Voice. It's 80 power. 
The user attacks the target using an angelic voice. This also confuses the target if the stats if their stats have been raised or have been boosted this time. Ah, okay. So it's like dazzling in, but it's better. Is it double target? I wonder if it's double target. If it's double target, that'd be kind of good in VGC. Wild. Wild. Okay, so let's have a look at the map. Let's see which one do we want to do next. Uh, I want to. I think I'm gonna leave the steel one to the last one. Let's do this one. Can we fly here. We can. All right. Cool. All right. Let's heal up. Heal him up. Oh, do you get BP? Uh, D pad right. There's a bunch of challenges that you have to do. All right. Sick. All right. Let's get it. Head over yonder. Is this like there? What's in here? Sandra. Oh, dude, I can't believe Dodo and Dodrio are back. They are so underrated. I want everyone to understand that. Dodo and Dodrio are such underrated Pokemon. If it was, if, if Two Cannon wasn't in this, I'd probably use uh, Dodrio. I'm not even in front. I totally would. I love that Pokemon. The team is cool. Thanks, Manar. I like using, uh, you know, some of my like favorites across the years and also like, you know, underrated ones and, and stuff. It's just more fun that way. Like two cannon is like not like the greatest Pokemon anywhere, but he's just, he's just like, I remember him so vividly from Sun and Moon. I'm a big fan of the baby birds, you know, like the Route 1 bird Pokemon. My eyes are peeled right now, bro. I want my DLC, le I want my DLC shiny. I would say I want it to be like Trap Inch or Vibrava, because that would be amazing. What challenge do I got right now? Take a, po a Pokemon of the Coastal. How do I get a Pokemon mid-flight? Vi does Vibrava count? Oh, Vibrava counts. Hold on. There we go. And then pick up items from the down. Sneak up on one Pokemon. Uh, let me just sneak up on... Who's around? You're around. There we go. Yeah, I'm happy all the stars are back too. Hey, 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 hey. Michael. Be my BP. You gotta make yourself a TM. All right, let's keep moving. Oh wow, we're already here. That's actually crazy. Wait, there's like, what the hell is going on over here? All right, yeah, main chest. <laughs> what the heck? What's that all about? All right, next elite trial. Let's think about this. If we're gonna be, I think in this case, if he's gonna have fire Pokemon, let's do a little swap out for Haku, right? And we will put you up the front. And I think Randy's just good as a support man. Well, I say support man, he just melts people. All right, let's get it. I'm glad they made terra changing Terra's easier really important. Duly received and noted. All right, let's bring it on. Let's go, Crispin! It reminds me of, um, Soma from, um, Food Wars. Oh, hey, I saw you in the cafeteria, you're Luki, right? Just the person to get my energy pumping. I feel like I'm cooking a nice simmer of it. Dude, it is so bright, my eyes. It's, it's too much. It's too much, man. Goodness me. Oh, he's a Magmortar. Look at him. I've been waiting for a fiery challenger like you. Taking on the Elite Four uh, pretty much right after coming out of school now. That's lit. <laughs> it's lit. Oh, no, what's it? What's it? What's it? Is it? It's lit. Uh, no wonder Kieran and Drayton like you. And if I'm being honest, you've kindled my curiosity too. I should warn you that my trial is no cakewalk. My elite trial is putting together a super spicy sandwich. I mean, super spicy on something so hot it'll uh, have me breathing flames. I know what you're thinking, that sounds easy, right? But you can't use your own ingredients. You have to negotiate with the elite club members around you to get what you need. Once you think you have all the right ingredients, come back and talk to me. Then I'll judge your sandwich making skills with my own two eyes. The key to cooking any dish is picking the right ingredients is the rest is easy as pie. Are you ready to take on my elite trial? Sure. So I need to get ingredients to make the spiciest thing. Right. 
Okay. He's from Verbank, apparently. Oh, that's cool. First things first, negotiate with the, uh, the league club members to get some ingredients. You need to make a super spicy sandwich. That should already be a clue for what you need. Once you've got the ingredients to whip out your sandwich, come give me a holler. All right, let's start this now. Okay, spicy. So, pepper. God, that's so spicy. Pepper's so spicy. All right, chat. Is there any Dr. Pepper around? That's even spicier. You got some Dr. Pepper? Eat me for a potato salad? No. What? What the hell? No. I want a bloody potato salad. Chorizons? Yes. Oh, jalapeno. Yeah, easy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you need prosciutto and olive oil. Okay, so I need prosciutto and olive oil. Chili sauce or ketchup. Three ingredients if you have the right answer. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's nice than 20, bro. Appreciate it. Okay, okay. So I need prosciutto and something else. I forget what it was. What did you have? Mayonnaise. No, absolutely not. Three ingredients if you give me something. I don't have any items on me. Dude, is that how many of these kids are there around? Is this like the... Yeah, okay, that's the limit. Right, right, right. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Let me see where these borders are. So I... Ha wait, wait, wait. This is insane. Do I need... Okay, so I'm gonna need to fight... Okay, I'm gonna need to fight this. Okay. Just give me this. Just give me this. Give me this. I'll kick some ass real fast. I'm not even gonna need the potato salad at some point in order to get someone else, right? So let's just do this. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. Turn the music up. I love the music so much. The fact that Kingdom gets skull this gamer, I'm I'm for it. I'm all for it. I can hear the voice of the potato salad speaking to me now. Okay. You sure? My potato salad. Go to the middle area, talk to the scientist girl. She will give a special item if you do her trial. It's the middle area, talk to the scientist girl. Gotcha. Three ingredients, chili sauce or ketchup. What's the vibe? Is that what you're looking for? Is that what you're giving? Okay, I'll trick. If you have a cucumber, I don't have a cucumber. Okay, so I saw somebody behind the rock. Yeah, what do you have? Oh, he has jalapenos as well. You're really good. You wanna battle me? I'll battle you, dude. Dude, he's talking to me whilst looking this way. He's like, yeah, bro, I'm really strong. Just so you know, you won't beat me because I'm too powerful. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Alright, that's Drought Solar Beam if I've ever seen one. That's, that, that's a Drought Solar Beam combo? Oh. Bro, bro, what? You can't talk a big game like that and then not come through. Easy, man. Talk to me nice, chat. Talk to me nice. Oh, he's got magma. Yes! I love Magma's cry, too. Yo, if you just had Drow on your team and a Corfell and all sorts, you could. this team could have been good. This could have been good, man. I love Alplum. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Second boy. Easy. This guy said he was strong. I one shot all his Pokemon. Prochendous Mons in Raw. <laughs> uh, hey, let's go! Wait a minute. 
Yo, King Gaming! Thank you so much for the XM membership, bro. Appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. A lot of pain, yo, what a burn. Give me that, give me them jalapenos. Give me them bloody jalapenos, no. Give me. I see you're a jalapeno worthy trainer. <laughs> All right, we're jalapeno. You don't have to heal my Pokemon, I'm, I'm fine, bro. I literally one shot you over and over again. Okay, so we got the jalapenos. There was no one else around here. So we have potato salad and jalapenos. What's your vibe? Mayonnaise? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'll bow you. I just want ingredients. That's right. Mayonnaise is not going to do me any good, right? But we need to get rid of potato salad, mayonnaise, and then one more item to trade for something else, so. Pyro and Pyro? I respect the commitment. Oh, wait. This is easy. Oh, this is done. Easy. Is mayonnaise an instrument? Yes. Precisely. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, I'm definitely glad I brought uh, Kingdra for this. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. All right, so we got jalapeno, mayonnaise, and something else with potato salad in the back pocket. Give me your mayonnaise. Thanks for the mayonnaise. Can I play mayonnaise? I could try. Three ingredients if you give me something. Or wait, what? Potato-y stuff. Yeah, take this. Okay, I got onion, cucumber, prosciutto. So I need, uh, there's the prosciutto. Okay, cool. So. Bring the right answer. What do you get when you mix eggs, oil, and vinegar? Mayonnaise! Okay, prosciutto, egg, olive oil, vinegar. Cool. We want chili sauce for cucumbers, right? So, change for chili sauce. Banging. Cool. And then you also had a jalapeno. Okay. And you need two, some prosciutto. Oh yeah, I got those now. Cool. Double the jalapenos, but the spicy boys. Um, marmalade and mustard. You're going to trade your vinegar? Yes, I want the mustard, for sure. Mustard is, it's not that spicy, but it is somewhat spicy. All right, chorizons. I want some eggs. I think I have eggs, right? Cool. Oh, yeah, chorizo. Yeah. It's like spicy sausage. Right, I think that's everything, right? That's got to be everything. Yeah, let's cook it. Let's get it. Yeah, I want to start. I can tell you're cooking at high heat. Let's uh, look forward to make something extra spicy. All right, let's have a peep. Is this enough? I don't have any sauce. Wait, where's my mustard at? What was it next? Ah, mustard chili sauce. Fiery pick. I love the little mag mortar pick. That's cute. All right, here we go. Okay, okay, let's do this right, let's do this right. We got, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm, chat, I'm not gonna make this appetizing. I'm just doing it so it doesn't fall off the bloody sandwich, okay? Just, just so everyone's aware. Just so everyone knows, this is, this is, this is like Jenga, but with sandwiches. I got plenty of sp space to work with though, I think. I should be good. Oh, chat, jalapenos are amazing. I don't like jalapenos, you're weird. You're weird. All right, there we go. It worked, it worked. There we go, done. Done, easy. Tell me that's not spicy enough. More time in the back. That's amazing. Easy. Uh. 
Even the spiciest of souls will be wowed by the spices you just delivered. I'm surprised you didn't put the bread on top, though. Is that a Paldean thing? Wait, what? Wait, actually! Anyway, you passed my elite trial of flying colors. You made a super spicy sandwich. So is that a Paldean thing? <laughs> okay. I didn't expect it to actually, because like, like, it's just easier, right? He says that Apaldean thing, bro. I'm going to enjoy the tingle on my tongue as we head back to the plaza. Apaldean thing. How dare thee? How dare thee? Don't laugh at me. It's just easier, man. I just do it by, by na you know, by natural now, you know? Well, that wraps up the trial, so now it's time for me to face me in an elite battle. You all prepped and ready to take me on? Yes, sir. Come in right up. Watch out, because I'm cranking up the heat. Bro, I can't see. <laughs> Bro, oh! It's like, I need dark mode. Oh, that's so much easier to look at. You know what I mean? Like, it's just, my, my eyes, it's easier on my eyes. Flashbang! <laughs> like, it's so bright in here! Turn down the exposure! Chat. Chat, I'm turning down the exposure. It's actually killing my eyes. Wait, look at this, look at this. Oh. Oh, my eyes. That is way better. What about the gamma? Oh yeah, let's crank it. <laughs> this is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. This is what I want to play my game like. This is exactly what I wanted today. This is exactly what I wanted to play my game like today. For God's sake. Right, anyways. My eyes! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's get it, Crispin. He's got a road to- That's my boy! Uh, now listen! That's my guy! He's got a road to him? Amazing. Amazing. Okay, let's scold the, uh, the road to him and... I think we can just try attack. Which choice? So I want to make sure- Oh, sunny day! To weaken the water moves! Okay. Goodbye, Talonflame. Is he sashed? Oh, wow. That's gonna do nothing. Oh, actually, I almost killed him. That's pretty respectable. Oh, it's a crit, too. He's gonna overheat. He's gonna overheat 100%. He's gonna overheat. He's gonna overheat, bro. I will have wisps. I'm not physical. That's fine. That's all right. That's okay. We just got to deal with... We just got talent frame to worry about now. It's okay. No worries. No worries. Okay. 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 So let's get the... Uh, let's get the Dragon Pulse on deck. Let's get the Tri-Attack on deck. I outspeed the Roll Tom, so... Oh! That was smart. I went for Dragon Pulse, though, so I think I should kill. Okay. All right, cool. First two down. I'm sure that thing had the... Well, no, it did have the heat rock. It had the focus sash. So, sun should go in like three or four turns. Camera up. I think Skull still kills, even in the sun. I'm not even going to lie. Exeggutor. Uh, that's fine. I can just try attack that, I think. He's got chlorophyll. Definitely chlorophyll, right? Let's hit him with a try attack. Out of speed. Choice Specs Adaptability Try. If I had terrored, he would have died. And we got the burn. <laughs> That's so funny. Well, Barry, you got Citrus and Harvest? Surely Citrus Harvest, right? Wow, that only does half. Here comes Solar Beam. Okay. Yo, the animation for that is actually sick. Heat wave. Oh, we're dead. Yeah, definitely dead. Nice. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, who do we bring in next? Who should we bring? Oh, there's the harvest and the berry. Yep. And now the berry's going to pop again. He 
This egg is just cooking right now. Oh, uh, yeah, let's bring, let's bring out of him. All right, let's get the, let's get the skull. We know skull will kill camera up. And we can just drill pack the executor for the for closing out on that. Easy. Look, see ya. Give it a bing. Yup. What's the last two? You wanna see a Charizard? You wanna see a Typhlosion? You wanna see a Blaziken? Embor? Oh, I love the Magma Water. That's his ace, right? Is it the last one? No way, right? Plays again. I knew it was going to be a starter. Yes! Oh, look at him. He's back, dude. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, I'm so happy to see Blaze again back. Wait, is this still Sun? Okay, yeah, the sunlight is still out. Okay, 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 okay. Let's Dragon Pulse the Blaziken and then, and we will... Oh, no, 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 Let's, 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 let's Dragon Pulse the Magmortar and then Grill Peck Blaziken. Magmortar, right? Not Blaziken. Surely it's Magmortar. Oh, shoot. It's not Fighting Type anymore. Oh! Oh dear! I need that sun gone, bro. That's heat wave. Damn! And that's Stone Edge. Yup! Okay, okay, okay. The sun's gone now. That's what matters. Is it speed boost? Don't tell me it's speed boost. <gasps> oh no. That's a little bit scary. That Blaziken's gonna be a problem. He's got the Pasho! There's no way! I can't believe that! I eat that. I eat that every day of the week. Yeah, I'm not even worried about that. No! He put the sun back on! No. Alright, melted. Alright, just the blades again now. You can only hit one of us. So all it is now is what? Uh... Is who's he gonna target? I think he might target. He probably target the Kingdra, right? Let's get the Dragon Pulse on, and then Psychic. Wow! He just went for it, dude. To be fair, he's put up a pretty good fight considering the situation here. Like I was rinsing him, and now these last two Pokemon, he's taken out half my team. Wait, I did nothing. Oh my god. Okay, he's got a Focus Blast, so I definitely cannot go into Arcaladon. Go, JJ. Let's hit him with it. What's he got? What's he got? What's he got? Overheat? Flamethrower? Flare Blitz? Temper Flare? What? What is Temper Flare? I feel like if he'd hit my Electro Electro Fire there, we might have been in trouble. Temper Flare? What is that? I love when they put new attacks in the game, bro. Thanks for 11 months, uh, Mike. Sick. I wanted to win, but I lost. Easy. Uh, give me a TM, bro. Right now, the mood of the League Cup feels, I don't know, off. It's so frustrating. I wish I knew how we could go back to being the fun club we were before. Hey, didn't mean to douse those flames there, Luke. You are real strong. Let me see if I can transfer that burning heat from our battle to my frying pan. I'll whip you up something great. 
Damn, Kieran really has ruined this place, hey. Kieran also gave you one of my favorite moves to something in the battle. TM207 Temper Flame. Spurred by desperation, the user attacks the target. This move's power is doubled if the user's previous move fell, so stomping tantrum. Yeah, you guys are right. Got no clue on how to manage the temperature of anything besides what I'm cooking. So all I can say is crank up the heat all you want in the BB League, Lukey. Okay, one more to do, and then it's on to Kieran. And then whatever happens in Area Zero after that, dude. Yo, 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 jam for the making. That's three of the Elite Four you've trounced now. Seeing how far you're getting is making me sweat a little. Chris, there's no pushover. He's just super straightforward. That's kind of part of his charm, you know? We all used to chow, uh, we used to all chow down on Christmas cooking after club activities let out. Those were the days. Guess he's been worrying about the, uh, the way things are too in his own way. You know, Bob, seeing skills like yours up close and personal really leaves an impression. No wonder it had such an effect on Kieran. But enough about that. I guess your elite fourth match is going to be against Amaris. She's colder still. You need something burning hot flames to melt her. We haven't got a fire type, I don't think. See you soon. Show us what you got. Yeah, this is going to be an interesting one. I don't think that our... Um, we can't really bring... Hydrapple into that one. I don't think. Yeah, we can't bring Hydrapple into that. We won't have enough... Um, we won't have the, um... It's like, obviously, Steel resists Grass and Dragon. We're better off bringing King Joe because it resists um, Steel and also can hit Steel-types neutrally. We have no Fire, we have no Ground-type, um, but that just makes it more the challenge, you know? So let's go Melter. Let's go do it. We haven't even been to this side yet, I don't think, right? So... We have Fighting. We have fire and fighting moves. But I like the challenge, dude. Yeah, give me my points. Give me my points. What is it? Go survive or defeat auto. Oh, yeah, or need to auto battle. Kill that, kill that, kill that. Why is that resisted? Do your thing, bro. Don't chase me. Get him. Get him. How do you get high drop You have to teach it a uh, dragon chair and then level it up once. No, he's right here. That one. Yes, yes. How many do I need to get now? Two more. Did you ever use these codes? No. Hold on. Uh, let's do it. Oopsie. So laggy. Let me see. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Uh, get with code. All right. So you said new moon. Is new moon is coming? Yo, we got a free dark ride. Yo, look at Darkrai, bro. Yay! Thank you. And there's another one, right? That is... Shiny Buddy.
And isn't the shiny Lucario? Yay! I got the I got the master ball. I already got the master ball. He's so good. I love Lucario. That's our boy. That's our boy. Cool. Which is bad, Goy? Gudra or Noivan? Uh, I like each, to be honest with you, but I'm probably more of a Noivan fan than Gudra, maybe. Yo, there they are. Let me just put them in here for now. So sick. They're in Cherish Balls too, classic. Alright, let's go. Oh my god. He's here. It's Scraggy. Well, him on Ch him on Chan him on Lee weren't in the game before, were they? Okay, it's like the 31 months, love. I'm gonna try him on Lee. I can't believe they're back too. That's so good. Look at him, he sits. He sit. He sit. Oh. I like how the dealing are in each corner as well. Dude, there's so many good items on the floor here. Flash, thanks for 26 months! Thank you guys. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Lime. I'm just glad to see how many Pokemon are there now that are in the game. We must be at like the 800 mark, right? Oh my god, the music remixes. Whoa! Where are we? What's with all the rocks? Keep your eyes peeled for a shiny, okay? Take a poke. Uh, is it Cleavor here? What the hell? What the hell? It's just a Cleavor chilling, man. That's wild. Oh my god, go look. What's up, bud? I was walking around with a metang. Alright, leads. Let's think about this. Uh, Adam is gonna be not good for this. Steel. Ooh, this is gonna be tough. We do not have a team for this. this one's, I reckon this one's gonna be quite hard. Alright, I'm gonna take a leak real fast, guys. One sec. Let's do this. I don't think this is going to go as well for us, but I'm going to give it a go anyways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes.
Why you talk like that, man? <laughs> Raven! Thank you so much! Guess I love the travel, Raven. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much for the gift tip. Make sure you say thank you. All right, what's the deal? The elite trailer devised starts right here. I call my challenge the flying time trial. This is where you get to fly. You learn how to permanently fly. To fly around the skies or a terrarium while riding a Pokemon. Reach the goal within the prescribed time and you will pass the trial. Fly through the Magnemite rings, and extra time will be added to the countdown. I recommend you go through as many rings as possible as you fly toward the goal. Can you verify you're ready and willing? Yeah, absolutely. What's up, though? Like 39 months, bro. Understood. All right. I assume you have a Pokemon to ride on. Please bring it out of its ball. He's back. Ah, oh, good. With some effort, this Pokemon should be capable of flight. Your name is Agius, yes? This is for you to eat. Argius. Right on is brimming with power. What your Argius just consumed is a supplement that enhances the Pokemon's flight capabilities. Noble Fall, thanks for the membership. I appreciate it. Thanks for the gifted. Appreciate you guys. Much love. I prepared it using leaves, a mysterious plant that was found growing in the terrarium. Dude, I'm sus about this terrarium, man, I'm telling you. Your Agias will be able to soar through the skies as it pleases, but only for duration of the trial. Try to reach the goal at the time by flying on Maridon's back. Passing through Magnemite uh, rings will give you, you extra time. You can freely uh, fly freely in any direction to the left stick. Okay. Alright. I love Agias. What a great Pokemon. You need a real Pokemon name that now. All right, this looks fine. Although I fear for the frame rate. I am so <laughs> fearful of the frame rate right now. Black screen. Damn, that really took a time. Whoa, this is weird. We're not descending. Whoa, this is crazy. Whoa, it's weird. I want it to be inverted. Normally, I'm, I'm used to playing like Lilac Wars or like Star Fox and it being inverted controls. It feels a little bit unnatural. I'm not gonna lie. I wish there was a way to invert the controls. Oh, dude, I think it's inverted. Oh my God, the inverted, the non-inverted controls are throwing me off. Can't see. Oh, I can move the camera. I'm stupid. It needs to be inverted. I'm telling you right now. It, it's that's what's making it feel. Ah, okay. Okay. Ah! Oh. I'm too. I pull up. Pull up. Pull up. It's actually throwing me off. That. Ah! Go up. Oh, I missed it. That's so hard. That is so hard when it's not inverted. What you're used to. That's crazy. <laughs> that's, a, that's a mess in the air, man. Uh, welcome to uh, Air Thunderbit. Um, this is Luke, your captain speaking. That was an impressive display of punctuality. I must admit it was satisfying to watch you fly. I'm glad somebody found it satisfying. You have cleared my trial. Now, a change of location required once again. Come. Come into the unknown. Um. All right, this is going to be um this is going to be quite challenging, I'm not going to lie. I'm just saying right now. It concerns Kieran. What is he to you, to you Luki? Listen. 
I was a fan of Kirim. He's, and I think he's persuaded by an um, other wealthy being. He's my friend. He is my friend. We'll fix him. So you consider him a friend. I see. Everyone else hates him. For my part, Kieran is the younger brother of my dear friend Carmine. Something about him has changed. He is not his usual self, and I find it deeply concerning. If possible, I want to be the one to help him. That being the case, I cannot afford to lose. Alright. Get ready, Skarmory. You too, Dutrium. We're finishing this battle right on schedule. Okay. So, the ground... I'm scared. So, I'm gonna go into this. Um... I think Thunderbolt's safe here, but Skarmory's definitely... I'm so glad Skarmory's like, I'm Skarmory's definitely gonna have a uh, 30. He looks amazing. Yep. The Earthquake Strats. Man! Of course you crit me! <laughs> yeah, there's a study. Stealth Rock! In doubles? Wow. This is problematic. Because I'm locked in the Thunderbolt right now. Wow. That thing is fast. Nice. They should still kill Skarmory. Damn, that did a lot. Okay, okay. I can't see my screen. <laughs> Okay, we're definitely getting an Earthquake. I'm gonna go to, um, Reuniclus. I can take hits. Ooh, Empoleon. Okay. Um... It's not a great matchup for me. But it really depends on what happens. I need to kill this Doug Trio for sure. I knew he'd Stone Edge. Yeah, I knew it. You couldn't, um, Earthquake. Miss! Nice. No, you didn't miss! Damn. Was I eating just some cables? Some sweet cables? Like ropes? Like sweet tart ropes? Okay. Alright. So this is JJ Easy. Been coming in and thunder punch this guy. Scizor. Okay. So I have a decision to make here. No, I don't like licorice. So I need... Uh, you know what? Empoleon's, Empoleon's more of a threat here. I'm gonna recover. Okay, cool. So providing uh, Scizor doesn't attack... Cool. Wow, that did a lot of damage. If I flamethrower, oh my god, I hope I out, I hope I outspeed now with that minus one. Do I actually thinking about it? Do I keep him around? Do I switch out? No, the stealth rocks are also a thing. <gasps> she also has a reuniclus. You copy. I'm gonna flamethrower. I'm gonna shadow ball your reuniclus. I resist this. I don't take it. Uh oh. Okay. All right. This is tough. Did 
the death drop. Oh, we get those. Trick room. Well, well, well. Okay, you're running lefties as well. Okay, that makes sense. So, do I go Duraludon? Or Arcaludon, rather? Just like that, we're back to full. Alright, then we got Arcaludon. And ideally, I want to take these guys out on the same turn, if I can. Because she's going to bring in a beater afterwards, right? So... I don't have anything for Sizzle, though. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. And hope we don't kill Reuniclus. Energy Ball's doing Jack Diddly Swat, dude. No damage. The only thing I'm scared of is him pouncing my... Sizzle. Okay, with the Spadaf drop, that's... Okay. Hey, he pounces. How much are doing? That is so much damage. And then my speed's dropped. Okay, it doesn't have paralyze, 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 paralyze. No, okay. This is gonna come down to the wire. I might have to take advantage of Regenerator here. Oh shit, she has a last Pokemon. It's Metagross, look at him! Um. Ooh. Okay. Even if I switch out right now. If I switch out right now, I'm not. I'm not gonna like get enough regenerator health. Alright, let's get it. I don't know if we can win this. Oh, I might outspeed. You're right. Trick Room's up right now. Oh, I should have attacked. I forgot about Trick Room. I completely forgot about Trick Room. Ow. Break, break. Come on, man. Yeah, defense buff. Do I live? I, I live. Okay, 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 okay. Keep reducing. Yeah, keep reducing my speed. Maybe the fastest thing on the field. Okay, right, so now, Reuniclus is so slow. Is there another trick room turn? Please tell me there's one more trick room turn. Okay, right, 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 right. So, he's gonna brick break me again. And I definitely don't survive that. Do we, with BD, Thunderbolt Scizor again, and then we'll Shadow Ball the Metagross just to bring it down? Because I outspeed everything now, right? Oh, wait, what am I doing? He's not... Oh, he's not psychic anymore! I made a mistake! I forgot! That was like half his health! I forgot I should have body pressed! You're right, I should have body pressed! I could have killed the sizzle! Oh, no! I threw! I threw big time! All I have is a king during a dream! All I have is a king during a dream. Trip him up. Alright, I have to protect. I have to protect. Okay, he's done having. Oh, we, we need we need a miss. We need a miss. We need we need a miss so badly. Okay, okay. I'm trying to think about how I win this. He's gonna aerial ace me, which is like, and he's technician boosted, so we're 90 damage move. If I could get the burn, but then I can't survive two attacks, there's no way. Oh, if I just killed the scissor earlier, this would have been way easier. No miss. Then have a regular stab that does a lot of damage. Okay, uh, if I wanna wait, he's gonna then headbutt me again. I'm Dark Terror. Dark 
Bun. Bun, 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 bun. Let's go! Zenepa! 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 Ah! Let's go! Alright, now, I don't think Bullet Punch kills me now, right? Ah! What are you saying? Ah! Let's go! That's what we're talking about. Kingdra coming in clutch. The strength of one's Pokemon reflects the strength of one's beliefs. Your desire to help Kieran is evidently greater than my own. No, you care plainly. You're good. You're good. You're good. Don't. I won't put you down like that. Look, you truly are a kind person. All right then, time for a photo. We must ensure that your victory here is properly commemorated. See, this is the way to do it. I don't want to see people doing this one. All right, it's this, okay? You got it. I'll give this TMT, what is it, what is it, what is it? Hard, so have body press and hard press? The target is crushed with an arm or claw. Uh, all the like to inflict damage. The more HP the target has left, the greater this moves power. So it's like, um, Crush Grip. It's up to you to help Kieran and Lucia and trust my wish to you. Time for me to go out. Is it, oh, is it like the user? Or the target has? It's like the target has, right? It's like Crush Grip. You know? Yo, 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 Trevor the Making, guess you're on with the champion the maid. As the BB Elite for all of us being, you scored every uh, every Elite one of us. Amara sure leaves an impression, huh? It's while seeing her and Carmine talk. You never guess it, but they click in a weird way. It's pretty funny to watch. The thing is about Amara is as rigid as she looks, she's got a sensitive streak uh, a mile wide. Remember that about her, okay? Even if it's hard to tell from the outside. Man, it's like I blinked and you plowed through the entire BB League. Uh, you know what sticks for you, right, bud? You're uh, good enough to beat. Uh, you're good enough to beat uh, all Elite four of us. So you and only you have the right to challenge a sitting BB League champion, Kieran. Oh. You already kept me waiting. I feel like he should be talking to me because he's got like some shit going on, right? I feel like I feel like he'd be <laughs> Took you a while to beat the Elite Four kind of slow for you, isn't it? Oh, ah, oh, creepy. Nice, Kieran. You've already got Luki on the brain, huh? Can't stop thinking about me. I could say the same thing about you, Drayton. You sure are putting a lot of effort in helping Luki out? You don't want to help out a new student? Gotta be good to our fellow humans. That's rich coming from you. Whatever you're planning is about to come to an end. Luki. Let's settle who uh let's settle who's strongest between us two once and for all. Right, chat. Do you want me to bring Ogapon? I have it. It's, the only thing is it's level 100. I don't make this fight easy for me. I have to sacrifice a mon on my team to bring it, lead with it, and then switch out with it afterwards, just so we can see if he brings up any dialogue. Because I do want to see that. I'll let you go to the, uh, start to the front desk to get your championship ma match. Go, no sense waiting around. Let's go. I'll bring her just to see what he says. Um, but it's gonna make me a it's gonna make it a little difficult to work around. What's up, Karma? Thanks for the six months. Who do we want to get rid of? I think the best part we get rid of Adam for now. Okay, we'll lead with it. And we'll see what happens. I just wanna see what he says. I'm just curious. I'm not I'm not trying to be mean or anything, okay? I just wanna know. I just want to see. Right. I'm actually nervous about this. It is very mean. But listen, we're rolling with it. Come on, like the 10 gifted. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Go to class 3 2 for the fly from my island. Thank you. Okay, I'll definitely do that. Class 3 2. Got it. All right. Right, let's sign up. 
What level is he, chat? What level is he? No kidding. Yeah, we are friends. Here's a Drace to take. I liked Kieran better when his hair was down. He used to be a quiet little guy, trembled like a leaf, had all the spine of a Wimpod. He'd hide behind Carmine if you um, so much as breathe too loud. But I tell you what, when it came to Pokemon Battle, I never saw so much joy in anyone's eyes as his. But then out of nowhere, he changed. Now he's relentless, pushes himself, pushes everyone around him. No, nothing's gonna, nothing good's gonna come of this. Someone's gotta snap him out of it. I tried to, but I couldn't. Um, I guess I got uh, soft in this lazy life. So now I guess it falls on you. Sorry, bud. No. Give me one second. Right, okay. So I'll tell you what, we will go. We'll get everyone to 85. Right, I don't know what his level is. This is crazy. We're having a Pokemon battle. We have to be level 85 for it. This is unprecedented for Pokemon. Okay. I have no idea how this is going to go. I'm going to be honest with you, but... Okay. I may lose here. Just so we know, I may lose. All right, let's get it. I could have brought Hydrapple, but I think Kingdra works better for my team right now. It's an official BB League announcement. A championship match is about to begin in the battle court near the entrance to the, Ad the academy. If you'd like to watch the match, please make your way there. Oh, oh, the cutscene kept me waiting. Works so hard for a chance to show what I can really do, Lukey. I put everything into studying and making my Pokemon stronger. Oh, come on, bless her! I crushed the Elite Four, became champion. All that hard work, all of it, just to crush you. All of it so I could beat you right here, right now. Yep. Dragonite Politoed. All right, let's see what he has to say. Let's see what he has to say about Ogapon. I know I'm making the right choice, you'll understand that soon enough. Surely it's dialogue, come on. You got some nerve bringing out that ogre now of all times? <laughs> Funny! Funny! Okay, it drizzled, it drizzled. Okay, question of the day, what do we do? Do I, um... Oh, I'm scared of a Yachi Berry play here, you know. I think I might Terra straight away and just start try attacking. Dragonite gives me- I, I'm not really scared of Politoed, I don't think. I'm just gonna try- I, he's got multi-scale anyway, so... It was all bait. I, te I sent him out to tease you, bruv! Hurricane? Nah, there's no way they made special Dragonite, right? I'll be surprised if they bring special dra special Dragonite. I will be very surprised. A burn will be amazing right now, uh, Porygon. A burn will be amazing. All right, no way. Weather ball. So we got the water water weather ball. Okay, fine. How'd you like that? See how hard I train? Not the little kid you battled and kick up. If I lose this fight, it's gonna be pretty bad. Oh, breaking swipe. That is fine. I live it. I always live those! Okay. Question of the day, does he have E-Speed? Question of the day, does he have E-Speed? I think I'm gonna Psychic the Dragonite and I'm gonna try attack the Politoed now. He doesn't. Choice Specs, Adaptability, Terra, Normal, Try Attack. <laughs> it's like a boss. Damn, he lived? 
Damn, he just naturally lived that. Oh, that's so sad. Alright, cool. That's fine. That's too much the psychic does. Another breaking swipe. That's fine. It's doing nothing to me. It's fine. Now, uh, since Porygon, Porygon outsped. What was your speed stat, buddy? It was 260. I want to say Kingdra outspeeds. I want to say Kingdra outspeeds for sure, right? Right, here we go. So let's uh, Psychic the Politoed and Dragon Pulse the Dragonite. Okay. Woo! Okay, I got a little bit scared, I'm not gonna lie. A little bit scared there. Wowzers, doesn't uh, matter the type matches work out for you though, I'll still win. He still says Wowzers at least, he's still in there. Cool. Yeah, the music is amazing. Okay. Grimmsnarl! Interesting. And then he's got his own Porygon Z! Okay, I'm a little bit scared of that, I'm not gonna lie. Grimmsnarl can take a back seat, I'm not stressed about that. I think we should just focus the Porygon Z. And since we got the rain up right now, that's fine. That's fine, that's not doing anything to me. I'm not worried about it. No crit, unfortunately. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That is gonna hurt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Porygon's lead lost on his HP. Okay, let's see here. So, let's get BD. I think we start to get BD up now. Fine. Dumb play. Easy. What's up, Cubby? Now, this flash cannon is going to eviscerate this Grim Snarl. See you later, buddy. Is he sashed? Wow. Okay. Right, okay, no worries. Okay, the rain's gone, so I can't take advantage of the skulls anymore. As he brings in Incineroar. Oh, shoot! Okay! Uh, I'm gonna switch out, I think. Oh, I wish I had my uh, Reuni. Oh, no, I can't switch out. No, I have to switch out. No, I have to go JJ, bro. I can't let Duraladon die. I can't, I can't let Duraladon die right now. Yeah, I'm gonna sculpt the Incineroar. Incineroar is so good. Damage. Citrus. That's fine. Another Skull kills. Another Skull kills. You also Flare Blitz. Oh my god! Okay. Spirit Break. Of course, it's a fairy move. That reduces special attack. Mm, okay. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. Um, so I'm going to have to Flash Cannon Grim Snow, and I have to hope that this Gold kills. I'm pretty sure it does. Even with the minor special attack, that's fine. Crit did not matter there, for sure. Even Lux chose another It's just not fair. It's just not fair! Oh my god! Okay. Does Arcalodon outspeed? It does. Okay, so we have a 2v1 situation. 2v1 situation. What's he got? What's he got? What's he got? What's his last Pokemon? 
Okay, he has Hydrapple. Okay, okay. Super sweet syrup. That's fine. Uh, this is great for us. We Dragon Pulse and we Ice Beam. And Hydrapple's got no speed behind it, right? Wait, what typing are you? Wait, what typing are you? I forgot about Terra. What is he? His smug face, bro. Fighting? Uh-oh. Oh, no. This could be awful for us. If he uses, like, Terra Blast on Arcaludon. I need to freeze. Dude, this thing is tanky. I'm capable of winning Tino. Victory will be mine and mine alone. Pickle Beam. Valid. Valid. Guys, I'm gonna have to finish him with Ogre Pond. I'm gonna have to fit. It's, it's, it's pretty poetic, to be honest with you. But I'm gonna have to finish him with, with Ogre Pond. Should I grassy train first? I'll grassy train first, just so I won't use an attack, right? Let's see. Let's see if we could have beaten it. I'm gonna outsped it. Dragon Balls comes out. That's enough to two cut even with grassy train. He terror blasts. He's terror blasting me. That kills me easily. Oh, it doesn't! We would have won! We would have won, bro! I can't believe that! Oh my god! We actually survive? And then Dragon Pulse again for KO. That is insane. One Mon down. And we still win. GG's. G G's, bro. Sheesh. What a crazy fight. Yeah, get fucked. What? Huh? Dude, Ogopon was just there cheerleading for me. <laughs> looky, looky, he's a man. If you can't do it, no one can. <laughs> wow, he actually lost? Oh, no. Let's go, guys. Why? This isn't. This wasn't supposed to happen. Oh no! 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 We gotta go, both of you. That was awesome. I want to see Christian read the room, would you? Look <laughs> at Dre. Oh, he's so smug, Drayton. Good match, you two. Too bad about the outcome, though, huh? Oh my god. I... Is he a bad guy? Long? X champion. Oh, he's feeding on it. He's playing on it so bad. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, 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 the smug. Look at you, buddy. Way to go. Guess we got a new BB League champion. The Academy's got a prize for people like you who make it all the way to being champion. Here, all yours. Oh, cute. I'll take another one. I'm Clinton Masterful's for fun now. Hey, Kieran. This may not mean much coming from a guy who couldn't beat you, but I wish you'd go back to having fun with all this. I get the, I get the burning desire to win. I mean, who doesn't like winning? But don't, uh, just don't let that desire burn you to a crisp. It's hard to watch. Come on, let's all go and... I'll win next time. Come again? I won't lose next time for sure, I'll win. I, I'll win next time. I'll win. I'm not saying anything right now. Lukey, I... Uh. Whew. Um, if we might um interrupt. Well, first, of course, we want to offer Lukey our congratulations for becoming champion. It really is an amazing achievement, something that should be celebrated. Well, the way things are now, I'm sorry to say that it does well complicate matters. We're having a bit of a hard time knowing how we ought to proceed. Proceed with what? 
I'll think about uh, think about it a moment, would you? If Luke is our champion, that means he's head of the league club. But he's an exchange student. What is our long-term plan here if he doesn't stick around? There are so many particulars to sort out. Oh, uh, yeah. Of course, if Kieran rejoins the Elite Four after having lost the rank of champion, that would push Crispin out of our ranks. Wait, what, me? That's bad, isn't it? I'd like to hear from Kieran himself what he'd like to do next. Get in. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. This is an announcement for the following students. BB League Champion Kieran, Top Elite Four member Drayton, Carbine of Class 3-2, Luki, our exchange student, Miss Bro- Hi. Hi. What's that all about? Now is really not the time. BB League Champion Kieran, huh? I think I need to update that. Damn, he's rubbing it in his face, dude. Drink, could you seriously not right now? It's just not right. It's certainly not kind. We shouldn't leave Miss Briar hanging. We'll never hear the end of it. Go on, Luke. We'll meet you there. I'll make sure Kieran comes to you, even if I gotta carry him. Oh, shoot, bro. He's rubbing it in his face. All right, well, GG's, guys. Uh, to be honest with you, I was, I was a Mon down. Mon down and still won. I, I definitely put him in his place. And now we've got the most exciting part of the story. We got some shit going down, let me tell you. Uh, who was it? Who did I replace on my team? It was two cannon, wasn't it? Let's get over one. There you go. Right. Class 3-2, baby. Hey, you want to go Class 3-2? Oh, you want me to do this now? That was sick, though. I honestly didn't think I was, I was going to beat him. Stay away. You guys stay away. I'm a danger to all who approach. Leave me be, okay? No. Wait, it's the impossible. Are you, are you like me? Yes. You must have heard the call. Yes. Let's see, what's called you here then? Chat, which one is it? The light. Oh, the hell, that's not really what I'm going for. What the hell? No. Yes. You must have the call, yes. They called you, uh, the wind? <gasps> you freaked out. The wind, I guess that's pretty cool. The wind, yeah, I the ring of that. You can feel it, right? The feel the stirring of power in your hand here. Chat, right or left? Right or left? Chat! Left? Left. Yes, yes, your left hand. I knew you were like me. Allow me to teach you, my kindred spirit, the sign of twilight. You learn, be still, my left hand emote from the boy. It, it, is, this what you, is this what you guys dragged me down here to do? <gasps> oh my god, look at that baby! Um, why did you guys send me down here? Yeah, I think he might be high a little bit. I don't, yeah, I don't really know what you guys, I mean. Why did you guys send me down here? Okay. Oh, is it after Terrapagos? Okay. Anyways, 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 anyways. As we were doing, we're going to, um, we're going to underground. Oh, where's my bloody OBS go? She's mega sus! I don't like her! She, she rubbed me the wrong way! She's hot though. I'm not gonna lie, she's pretty hot. Alright, here we are, Miss B! Thank you all for coming. I'm pleased to inform you that we have some very special guests. I'm here to see you today. They left for a tour of the school mere minutes ago, but I believe they'll return soon enough. Oh my god, her eyes. Jesus. Hi, Vinny! In the meantime, I'll fill you in on the situation. Please have a seat. Don't mind if I do. These knees are creaking. Look at my bestie! Oh, please. You're not all in the flat yet. Ah, oh, Lukey. I heard you were busy battling your way up the BB League, but I think you make it as far as a champion. What a dazzling accomplishment. Thank you so much, Miss B. <gasps> Salty. Sorry, Miss Briar, but we leave that all for another time. What's this thing you want to tell us all about? 
Yeah, read the fucking room, Miss B. My apologies, that was insensitive of me. Let's get straight to today's topic then. I want all of you here to join me on an expedition to the secluded and mysterious Area Zero. Area Zero, that's the place in Pal Day you wanted to visit, right? You got permission? My main goals are to investigate the terrestrial phenomenon and gather samples of the crystals present in the crater. But to be honest, I also have one more ambition on this trip. I'm hoping that we can find Terrapagos, the legendary Pokemon slumbering in Area Zero. Terrapagos, a legendary Pokemon? I'm rather excited. Oh, look who it is. Oh! Rika and Gita? There you are, Gita. Let's just getting the kids up to speed. I do apology for my I apologize for my tardiness. La primera! Mm, look here, so I didn't expect to run into you here. Ah, oh, of course, we're participating in the student, uh, the student exchange program. Luke just got crowned our new BBR League champion too. The talent is brilliant as always, I see. Truly a wonderful thing. If you'll be going along, then I suppose that bodes well. Is it alright if I explain the situation to the children, Briar? By all means. First, allow me to introduce, you, introduce myself. My name is Gita. I am uh, the chairwoman of the Pokemon League in Paldea. More than a decade ago, the Pokemon League provided support for re research on Area Zero, the great crater at the center of Paldea. Once that research was complete, we shifted our duties to monitoring and managing the area. Area Zero is full of mysteries and also danger. Generally speaking, the area is off limits, even for research. That being said, Recently, we had to confront the possibility that dangerous Pokemon could escape the area. There's a clear need um, need for further research and quickly. But our, at our Pokemon League, we've had trouble finding capable personnel. Not to mention time to study Area Zero. So, you reached out to me uh, as I've been requesting access to the area for some quite uh, for some for quite some time now. I apologize that we were not better equipped to deal with this ourselves. Blueberry Academy has a wealth of highly skilled trainers with well-trained Pokemon. And with Champion Luki also on the team, I'd know uh, I could safely initiate a new expedition. Yeah, but you didn't know I was going to be here. So it's almost something that you're bringing me into your argument for bringing us down. I, you didn't know I was going to be here until just now. This is entirely voluntary, of course, but it would be very reassuring to have you with us. What do you say? Will you join our little team as we explore Area Zero? Absolutely. Splendid. Well said, Champion Luki. Uh, well, I think it's already decided that I'm going. Your support will be very useful as always, Carmine. I appreciate having you on board. Sorry, but I'll pass on this one. The league club's a whole mess right now. We need a steady hand on the wheel here. Sure, you just can't be bothered to travel all the way to Paldea, can you? <laughs> Guilty. I'm curious what our mighty ex-champion is thinking, though. I'm going. If there's a legendary Pokemon there, I want to find it and catch it. This time, I won't let it let, let this chance go. Interesting. Then it's decided. It's too bad that Drayton won't be joining us, but it seems that the team will consist of Carmine, Kieran, Luki, and myself. Yeah, my thanks to help, uh, for your help on this matter. I look forward to the great findings that you will uh, no doubt bring back. I'm grateful for the opportunity, Gita. Leave it to me. My drama, my dream, sorry, of exploring Area Zero is finally becoming a reality. Now, time to prepare. Let's meet by the bridge and the Academy entrance as soon as we're ready. Wow. My team is fucking dead. Alright, let's get it. I hope you're not in a hurry to leave, Champion Luke here. I'd much like to chat a little longer. What's the vibe? Uh, what's the vibe, Gita? What's the vibe? It's been a while, Luki. Hi, hey, kiddo. Rika's here too, at your service. Not gonna lie, I've never dreamed we'd be running into you. I saw that you're putting your skills to good use and living up to your title as Paldea Champion, even while abroad. That's what champions do. <laughs> Indeed. I would expect nothing less from a talented trainer just such as yourself. Yeah, definitely got talent. Lots of talent. All right, it's easy to be jealous, though. But I'm not gonna- not enough to get you off the hook! You went into the great crater without the League's permission, didn't you? Don't think you're gonna get- not gonna get a scolding for that. That's what champions do! Yeah! <laughs> What's that got to do with anything? You can't just go breaking rules willy-nilly! Calm down, Rika. No harm came to him after all. And besides, we have good reason to believe that all of Paldea would have been at risk if Champion Luke hadn't ventured into, the, into Area Zero. Well, yeah, I mean, it's true, but... Fine, I'll let you off the hook this time. You think you better thank the boss for stepping in. Don't think poorly, Eureka. She's just worried for you. <coughs> now then, Luki. <coughs> this time you'll be heading to the area zoo with official league permission. Only a handful of people know about the incident involving the time machine. However, taking into uh, account the dangers of Area Zero, I've elected to inform Miss Briar of what's been uh, of what happened, obfuscating uh, obfuscating certain details. Speaking of boss, didn't you say you had something to give that Briar person? 
Yes. Yes, I did. I forgot about that. Champion Luki, would you be going to some kind of take this one? The Indigo Disc. A mysterious disc with an indigo shine to it, given to you by a top champion. Oh, we're going to have to put this into a machine and it's going to open up something, right? What is that anyway? A TM or something? It's a disc that was sent by an Area Zero researcher to an investigator some time ago. I had my investigation team look into it. It's certainly not a TM, nor is it a mere tool for storing data. Honestly, I have no idea, uh, idea to uh, uh, as to its true purpose, but I assume it has something to do with Area Zero. I figured that since you're heading to Area Zero, I might as well ask you to inve investigate the purpose of this disc while you're there. While he's there, huh? Did you want him to pick up some potato salad on the way back too? I do ask that you return the potato, potato salad to me if you end up not finding a use for it. <laughs> There is still much we do not know about Area Zero. I know you've already been into its depths, but please exercise some caution while dealing with the environment and Pokemon there. As the champion, it falls on you to protect and uh, uh, guide those accompanying you. I wish I'd go with you, Killer, but I've got my own work to do. Do your best down there. Don't push yourself too hard, you hear? Now, please excuse us. Well, sure seems like there's some suspicious stuff happening. Uh, yeah, we all got the entrance, right? All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Where's the vibes at? Oh, there they are. Here's the gang. The gang's all here. Yep. Why is Kieran so miserable, man? Get a grip. <laughs> all right, let's get it. I'm finally ready to set off them. Are you two feeling all right? I don't have to travel at least. Well, I'm I'm fine anyways. Yeah, me too. Look at his hair tie, man. I've had time to calm down. Oh well, that's good. I'm fine. I know what I have to do now. I have to catch Terrapagos. Yep. Yep, I knew it. Is that what he's going to take from us? He's going to take Terrapagos from us? That's the spirit, Kieran. Completely unbeknownst. All right then, shall we? All right, this is what I've been waiting for, man. Just finding out what the hell is happening down here. Is the time machine a real time machine? Is it a dream machine? What's the vibe? We made it. I'm finally here. Area Zero, the place I've dreamed about for you. Look at her face, chat. Oh, this is incredible. Wowzers. Look at her face. She's losing it. Uh, so you've been here before, right, Luki? Yeah, my friends. Friends, huh? Be right on! The boy! Oh, you scared me. Honestly, you're too big coming and popping out like that, you watch him adon. Me? <laughs> so you came with Luki back then too, huh? Mr. Pokemon was reportedly first discovered in Area Zero. I'm very intrigued by this specimen, but alas, that's not what we're here for. We're here to go to the deepest depths of Area Zero. And see what's even deeper. What do you mean, even deeper? Heath mentioned in his writings that he fell from the depths to some place even deeper. Wait, hold on. Doesn't the depths imply that he was as deep as he could get? Yes, it's quite curious, isn't it? However, Heath also wrote that he was utterly unable to recall how he got down there. If his writings are to be believed, there must be an entire uncharted space below it. Area Zero. Well, either way, we should start by making uh, making for Area Zero, uh, for Zero Lab down in the depths. You take the lead, Luki. Let me walk all the way down there. Can I just fly down there? I've been around there enough. I know this place at the back of my hand. All right, this is cool. All right, let's go. Right, let's go. Let's go. All right, let me just heal up my guys. <laughs> I didn't realize that I still had not healed them yet. So let me do that real fast. Alright. My mons are still passed out from the last fight they had. 
Alrighty. Oh wow, I was literally a slither away as well. That's crazy. We're back again. Back at the gate. Well, this place is insane. It reminds me of the crystal pool. This is the zero lab, I take it. The structure's exterior matches Geeta's description at least. So this is the deepest point in area zero? Nope. Well, yes and no. This is the deepest point of area zero expedition managed to reach long ago. You know, I've been told that the lowest level of this laboratory contains a mysterious room whose purpose is entirely unknown. However, where I want to go is even deeper than that. So you're saying we should head inside the zero lab? Gate's closed though. Uh, oh, you're right. What do we do now, Luke? You've been here before, right? Wait, I just pushed A. We need to use what? What did I say? What was the option it just said? Uh, well, this feels like a spy movie or something. Way cool. Oh, his innocence is showing a little bit. Oh, he's coming back, man! Like, did you see that? Oh, I miss the old Kieran. I miss the old Kieran. I miss the old Kieran. Bring back the old Kieran. Well then, can we count on you to unlock the gate, Luki? Yeah, I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. All right, before we go any further, I need to pee again, chat. I'm pissing like a fountain right now. Be right back. One sec. Don't totally don't gift any members while I'm gone. Like, don't do that. All right. <laughs> Oh, bless you guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. <laughs> you guys all make me killing my sleep schedule. You make it worth it. I promise. Thank you very much. Let me put my heat, uh, my heater, my, um, fan on. Oh, my goodness. All right. <sighs> Let's get it. Thank you guys so much for generosity. I do appreciate it. Right, here we go. Get bell. A dreepy too. Yep. Open the gate to zero lab. Yes, sir. Access revoked due to prolonged inactivity. A lent entrance has been locked. Interesting. Something wrong with it? Open before, right? Is there an extra step we're missing? Uh, there were. F there was a professor in the lab before. See, so last time we went through a series of steps on not the gate, and the professor was also there to guide you from the inside. Indigo disc detected. Indigo disc detected. He's talking! In insert indi indigo disc for greater access privileges. Insert the indigo disc for uh, granted to be granted uh, administrator privileges. What could it mean by that? Oh, yeah, that's right. I need to give you this. Oh, Gita gave you a mysterious item and she departed. Uh, I think that's it. Oh, how fun. Go on, Luke. You do it. You have my permission. Please insert the disc. In you go. In you go, disc confirmed. Zero lab elevator redirected to area zero. Area zero under depth. Oh shit, dude. Look at that, it opened. Let's head on in. Um I have the heebie jeebies. Is that fair to say? I have the I have the heebie jeebies. I have the I'm noivous. I'm noivous. It was just like yesterday that we were here. You know? 
I miss Toro. She fall over? It's way too dark and I just smacked my head on something. It's because you're running around without any idea where you're going. Wow, Kiki. Sounds like if someone's finally breaking out of their funk. Hmm. Shut it. Where's Miss Briar anyways? Wait, good point. Oh, she's busy rummaging through like a whole stack of documents over there. Aren't those someone's private photos and stuff? We probably shouldn't be looking at all that. Oh, you're awfully considerate all of a sudden. Miss Briar, look, an elevator. Maybe it can take us further down. You wanted to go down, right? Down, you say? She's she's freaking me out, bro. I'm telling you. There's, something, there's just something not right. Oh my, did you see the did you use the elevator last time you reached the mysterious room I mentioned earlier? I sure did. How exciting. I've got no time to waste. Let's go down. So we're gonna go past the 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 We're gonna go past the teleporter. Right. Ah, wonderful. The this elevator just keeps going further and further. That's what elevators do. You know, it's moving pretty fast, actually. It almost feels like I'm floating. Hey, everyone. The panel that we used to unlock the gate, didn't it say something about where the elevator goes? Not that you mentioned, yeah, something about the elevator being redirected, right? As far as I know, there's only one elevator inside the Zero Lab, so the panel must be referring to the elevator we're currently inside. So where exactly is this thing taking us? Where indeed? She is making me nervous. I would not like to be around this adult. We are going. It is still going down. We are at the core of the Earth. The music change? Oh my. Oh my goodness. So what, are we under area zero or something? That's according to my day. She has the Scarlet book as a phone case. Oh my God, look at her. She's got, she's, she's spit. You know? Yes, according to my data, our current position is far deeper than we last were. Could the elevator have taken us even further down than its previous destination? Man, Area Zero is a lot to take in. I don't think anyone's uh, gonna surprise me at this point, no matter what we run into. Hey. What's all this stuff? Oh! What are desks doing down here? Oh my. Oh my, this is... This is a report written by the esteemed Professor Toro. A massive cave... Uh, here we go. A massive cavern exists beneath Area Zero, and there slumbers Terrapagos, the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Its body has become crystal, protecting it from hostile outsiders. It appears that, uh, that rousing it will take some time. In this cavern, I have witnessed the terrestrial phenomenon occurring in a way that I've never seen above ground. Terrestrialization that appears to hold the power of every known type. I have dubbed this terror type the Stellar type for now. Could Terrapagos' influence be at play? Terrapagos is the hidden treasure of Area Zero, and it's slumbering in a form of a crystal. And what is this about the Stellar type? Brilliant. Absolutely marvelous. To think there was so much that Heath didn't write about. These documents are a veritable treasure trove, and we've only just began our, our expedition. I think, T I think T2 and uh, the, the rest of the, the community figured out that it was going to be called the Stellar type. I don't know. Uh, she can get so excited in a bizarre place like this. The legendary Pokemon Terrapagos. That's the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Come on, let's hurry up and go further in. I still haven't got my fill on these documents, but okay, let's go. It would be best to discover the truth with our, with our own eyes, after all. Let's keep moving. Stay on guard, everybody. Dude, this is cry. This is crazy. Is this it? What is this? It's like a crystal trying to be a flower. It's completely blocked up the path. Yeah, we're not going any further with this in the way. Uh, what about that Watchmedon? That Pokemon you can ride on? Couldn't it smash through? Let's give it a go. Let's see if ride on will do its thing. Hold on, please, please hold on. 
It's quite likely a manifestation of pure terrestrial energy. We have no idea what might happen if we destroy it with brute force. Okay, so what do we do then? Hmm. There's a Glamora. Is there a Pokemon all the way down here? What's going on with this one? It seems to be charged with some kind of strange energy. Hey, get back! You know you're no good. Uh, you're no good. Uh, you're no good in a battle, Miss Briar. No, Lukey. Oh, she said Kieran, and then she goes, no, Lukey, you do should do this. Yikes. Yeah, I mean, I could beat its ass. Is it going to be stellar typed? Is that what's going on? Okay, well, I got the type matchup. Well, that's that energy. It, it couldn't be. Yo, look at it. Scroll is still super effective. Uh, GG. It's fine. Ah, oh, all right. Well, that was a little bit anticlimactic, but. <laughs> it won't let me catch it. <laughs> I wanted to see. I wanted to see. I wanted to catch it so I could see what his terror type was. So we found out nothing. We found out nothing. Good work, Lukey. Oh. Oh, it disappeared. Did knocking out the sparkling Pokemon make the crystal flower disappear? It's just like the report we found earlier. What we just witnessed was a Pokemon wielding the powers of each and every type. That must mean it must have the speller terror type. So what's that all mean? Wait, was that supposed to be the so-called treasure we're looking for? I can't say for certain, but no, I, I don't think so. The professor's note said there's a hidden treasure of Area Zero and it, it's slumbering in a crystal form. The glimmer you just fought off doesn't fully fit that description, so I don't think it's the Pokemon that Professor called Terrapagos. Well, the only way if, uh, to know if, if it's the hidden treasure is not is or not is to keep going. Come on. All right. Okay. A stellar terror shot. On rare occasions, these shards. Ooh, okay. Let's go check out this. Um, is there anything else here? Treasure and a stellar type. Um, let's have it. Yes, we read that one. I'm calling the area I found below the areas of the areas are under depth. From, uh, from the composition of the rock, I would date the cavern's formation to two million years ago. There are indications that many objects or creatures perhaps filled the space prior uh, to the current cavern's formation. The depths bottom out, uh, the depths bottom out approximately 3,300 feet beneath the surface. There, there are indications of numerous past cave-ins, likely resulting from tectonic uh, activity and erosion caused by rainwater or groundwater, but it appears the ground has remained stable since the last major cave-in. While investigating the hidden treasure, I found myself suddenly transported to a great height near a lake that smelled of sulfur. Wait, is is that in Kitakami? Is that the Kitakami? Pool of water? Based on temperature and, hu and humidity, I believe it to be uh, to have been the eastern lands I've read about before. And there, a child gave me a child gave me a white volume. What? That's the that's the crystal pool, right? A white volume. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Interesting. It's carving. Stella Terra shards. Glimits. Imagine Diancy shows up. Is 
Since I found another one of those crystal flowers, could the terrestrial energy be saturated in the air? Uh, it's so we have to fight this up there, right? What is that? You have Flygon? What's the noise, Ryan? I thought, I'm not gonna lie, chat. I thought it was an Aerodactyl for a second. Holy shit. I don't wanna, I don't, I don't know if I wanna know what happens if I go down there. Oh shit, I'm about to find out if I'm not careful. On the item. How do I let go of the, uh, there we go. I'm just gonna assume I'm gonna have to kick the Neuven. All right. It's gonna be Stella. Okay, this thing should outspeed the hell out of me. Right? And it should Drake at me. What level is it? 78? I still have to Yeah, easy. I froze it. <laughs> Unfortunate. That's so funny. So it's, it's black in Scarlet? So it's a white and a black, as a white and a black volume? Dude, what is happening? There's so much Gen 5, like, love right now. My Unovan fans are eating right now. I did wonder when it said it was a white volume. So it's gonna be a white and a black volume? Dude, I have to know. I have to know what's... Are they, they, they are, they've been mega hinting to black and white, dude. We all knew Gen 5 was coming, but it's so nice to see that it's like hinted. A Pokemon's called me right on, right? Boy, it can really jump. We're on a roll. Let's keep on moving. What if like, you know, at the end of this DLC, we just transport to Unova and we have Gen 5 remakes already. They just, they were nested inside this update. Another Glimmit. More crazy terror. Right, okay, so we gotta find the the next one. Found it. Give me the item. What is that? Is that is that an iron thorns? It is. Wait, they can't terrestrialize, can they? No, they can terrestrialize. I'm stupid. Alright, Haku. I'm gonna scold this boy. It looks pretty, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I just realized it's a little Terrapagos turtle in the middle. That's what it is in the middle. It's like a little, it's a little, it's a little. Terrapagos. I hadn't noticed that. Go. Cooked. Oof. Nah, let's head back over. The book is white in both games, are you sure? I need someone to go watch a Scarlet playthrough now and tell me if it's a black volume. It's a white volume in this version too? Okay. Okay, that's, uh, that's unfortunate. If it was white and black, that would have been pretty cool. But who knows? It might still be a reference. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah, the white volume is still pretty interesting, though. 
Now then, it appears as the terrestrial energy uh, around us is growing more dense the farther we go down. Come, we've no time to lose. Oh man, we're getting there. We're close. We're close. I can feel it. Okay, so we have another one here. So, where is... Wait, is this water? Like... I don't want to get my clothes wet. Okay, pile it. Alright, there it is. What is it? Is that Garganackle? Well, Kingdra's just been the one right now, dude. Whoa, holy shit, this is the tree. This is the tree. Yeah, Kingdra's been doing the most right now. Everyone's weak to it. This is the tree from the trailer. Okay. Listen, one skull just to dispatch you real fast. Trust me, we'll, we'll see plenty of um, this stellar type, I'm sure, as we get deeper in here. Dibby -dib -dib Yeah, the terror is crazy, right? There's a stellar, the stellar terror. Oh, Kiki, you can, you'll turn a call over, Luki. <laughs> Maybe he'd rather have you do it. Quit your blabbering, just do it! <laughs> They're back to normal! They're back to normal! Hey, the path opened up, we can keep going! Yeah, but hold up a second. Hold up a second. Is that a hub of Mystica? Nah, look at this tree, bro. Are you just gonna put me in this room and then have me leave? That's crazy. Wait, where was the exit? Okay. Hey! We're being a crap ton of terror shots. We had to make a stellar poke one in a minute, anyways. Oh, Kiki, isn't that something you wanted to say to Luki? No, not really. Just feels like we're all relying a bit too much on him is all. We should keep going. Oh, he's so stubborn. Yeah, you two are simply dazzling as always. Just so you know, we were also fending off wild Pokemon while you were away. So me and my team are just about spent. Sinister is all I've got left, so if something happens, you better save me. <laughs> They're my bestie. Whoa, holy shit. My tower orb, I think it's reacting to something. Oh, you're right. Mine is two. I'm picking up truly astounding level of terrestrial energy. How could she just pick it up? It seems to be coming from in there. Are we finally at the finish line? The hidden treasure. Bro, Kira's gonna snatch that ish up right now. The truth behind the Violet Book is so close now. Oh, oh you too! Those two sometimes, I swear. Oh, there we go, chat. Here we go. Yo, the black. Yo, the floor being like completely black is crazy.
What is this place? The vibes are on a totally different level. The hidden treasure. Where is it? There, Kieran, up ahead. There's something among those pillars. All right, this is where Tarapago shows up. Yeah, there he is. Yep. This stone's the hidden treasure? <coughs> Give me a moment. I just need to check something. I can get the hidden treasure area zero. I can finally beat Luki. Kiki, you're still going on about that nonsense? Shut it, sis. Luki has everything I've ever wanted. He's got a strong poke where he can go anywhere he wants. He can be friends with anyone. I loved Ogapon things forever ago, but even Ogapon chose him over me. But Kiki, you did your best too. Even you, sis. You've been all nasty towards him at first. Then boom, you're like best friends in no time. I, well, I got nothing. I worked so hard, and for what? I'm so lost in the end. This, this is all I have left now. Found it. This crystal is definitely what we're looking for. Go on, Karen, pull with everything you've got. Show us the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Yo, she is feeding it, dude. She is shit staring. It's a rupee. That's one rupee in, in, in Zelda, you know. There's no doubting it. This crystal must be Terrapagos. Whoa. It's getting bigger. Oh, he's so precious! It's a baby! <laughs> it's tiny! No! You're mine! Oh, he sniped it. He sniped it right. He said, fuck you, that's mine. That was Terrapagos, you caught it, right? Finally. Very well done, Kieran. The fact you brought on a master ball tells that you are prepared for this. Now I can study Terrapagos whenever I want, but there's no time like the present. Think you give us a little demonstration of Terrapagos' power right now? Oh, you heard her, Luki. I'm also itching to see what Terrapagos can do. Get ready so we can start. Oh, shit. Bro, his cry is the sound of, t uh, of terror. So wait, hold on. Am I the right level for this? I feel like I'm not the right level for this, but... Listen, I like a challenge. I enjoy a challenge. Kingdra's not been letting us up, so let's just run it, bro. Yeah, 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 hit me. All right, get in position. Yeah, Briar's just... Yeah, she's crazy. She's crazy. I hope you've braced yourself. This time I'll definitely beat you. Let's run it. Oh, it's a single battle. He set out to rap. What type is it? What type is Terrapagos? I want to say it's rock. Go, Terrapagos. Show Luki what you're made of. Is it just, is this the only Pokemon? Terra Shift. Wow. Uh, so this is the hidden treasure truth for my, with this I can win for sure. Hold on. Made it shell gleam, it's distorting type matchups. Every, it resists everything? Does it resist everything? Or just the first hit? It, okay, so I think its ability shifts the type matchup. So now it resists water. Oh, nice crit. We'll take that. How can you critical hits even at a time like this? What are you, the hero of this story? <laughs> yes, sir. Tokens' power should be far greater than this. Could we miss, miss, be missing something? All right, this is, this is, this is, um... okay.
Okay, kill one of my Pokemon. Just fine. It's got like a crazy weird health bar anyways, right? So... Right, let's try let's try hitting it with a with a normal move. Let's hit it with it. Yes, sir. What's going on here? He doesn't look happy about that loss, I'm not gonna lie. I like how his game that the, the the, the sound we've been hearing this entire time of terror crystalling or terror uh, terrestrializing has been his cry. It's that. But why? I thought if I just had Terrapagos, if I had the hidden treasure area zero, it would make me stronger. I thought I. It, it, how he beat Luki. That's enough. It's time to stop this. No, oh, something's not right. This terrestrial en uh, energy output is far too low. Not to mention the fact that it looks different in the illustration of the Violet book. Wait, are we talking about the big one? The big the big disc? So, Terrapagos isn't the hidden treasure area zero? No, I'm sure it is. We must be missing something. A way to transform it into the treasure. Of course, Terrapagos is made of terrestrial energy. Kieran, you must terrestrialize Tra Terrapagos this instant. If my hunch is correct, Tra uh, Terrapagos will resonate with the energy from your terror orb. And the hidden treasure will finally reveal its true brilliance. Got it. Okay, I thought this was a bad idea. We saw how big that thing was in the book. That thing was huge. We're gonna have to raid battle it. I knew it! The Violet Book was right! Thank you, thanks for the gifted. Appreciate that, thank you. This is the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Is it the crown? Yeah, there's the crown. Do I save him? Am I, am I the goat? Yes! Let's go on the right on! Talk to me, nice! Look at him! What a good boy. Uh, I think they're getting out of hand, Kiki! You should return to our goes to its ball! Uh, okay! Come back! I won't go back inside! Oh shit. He said, he said, nope. <laughs> I'm good. It broke a master ball. Oh, you got match, you guys. That's all you got? Is it just me and Carmine? It's me and the bestie. It's energy out, but it's going haywire. We're all in serious danger. We can't bring it under control. This was your fault. I'm sorry, kids. Please, you need to stop Terrapagos. This is your fault. Come on, Kiki, do something too. We got to get Terrapagos under control. No, this wasn't supposed to happen. This is all my fault. It's just me, it's me and Carmine. All right. Can I terrestrialize? Can I terrestrialize? I can't terrestrialize. All right, it's just a try attack. It's fine. That's pretty good damage. Get paralysis. We can't get paralysis. It's got shield up. It's using a barrier to reduce damage. In that case, terrestrialize might my help. I tried to, wouldn't let me? Terra Star Storm. Don't kill me. I swear to God. I swear on everything that is holy. If you kill me right now. That was sick. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. Matcha gotcha! Oh, you did pitiful damage, I'm not gonna lie. How much HP? You got, 11, you got 9 HP back from that. Can I Terra, please? Ah, oh, dude, if I, if I can't Terra... Thank you. Thank you, Carmine, thank you. Okay, this is, oh man. I don't know if I want to terrestrialize next turn. Is it gonna be worth it? I think I should save it, right? I don't know if I should terrestrialize. The game wants me to. Fine. I'll do it, fine, fine. The game wants me to take my choice spec adaptability Terra normal, try attack. What does it do? Yeah, can you stop using the... Don't use the Star Storm move. Use a, use a normal attack. 
This is gonna do insane damage. The crit as well! That's- Are we paralyzed it? Oh my god, the gods favored me on that turn, let me tell you. Damn. Absorb thrust. I'm already thrustalized. Oh wow. It broke the thrustalization. What? It absorbed thrustal energy? It said, <laughs> nope. You don't get that. Oh, wait, that's gonna hit. Okay, cool. So I get to survive this. Did you notice it just boosts from, uh, Zen Headbutt too? It's either, either those two moves are both psychic or it gets terror boost from any attack now. Oh no, my sinister's not that. This isn't good. It's just too strong. Alright, I built another shield up. Where'd it go? Don't tell me it went ghost type. Don't tell me it went ghost type. I'll be pissed. I can't touch a ghost type. You need to get in there, Battle Kiki. Luki's doing all the work. It's no good. I'm useless. Come on, Kieran, bro. I need you. I need you right now. Wait, don't. Just don't tell me it's ghost type. I'll be mad. Okay. Still neutral. Can we tell what typing it is? Okay, I'm dead now. That's a pretty crazy move, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, okay, okay. What typing is? Like poison or psychic? Um, yeah, something like poison or psychic, right? Okay, let's go gerbil. Let's go gerbil. I'm gonna try throwing a psychic move at it right now. I'm gonna throw a psychic move at it. Is, that, is this a physical? It's gonna be special move, right? Oh my god, he crit me in it. I still. That was pretty good. Pretty, I, I was respectable. No, it's resisted now, so it has to be psychic type. So wait, sh 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 should I. I should channel ball, right? Wait, one of. Wait. One of the. One of the. Did you see that? One of them's grayed out. I can't, I can't see what type it is though. Which one is it chat? I can't tell which one it is. No, it's not. It's not psychic. What is that? Well, you, it's, I, what was this psychic? The super fed of being psychic. What typing is it? I can't tell. We might have to start reviving Pokemon in a second. Oh my god, it's got Earth Power. That's why I forgot about that. That's right. Yeah, Dark is immune. It's definitely not Dark. I used Psychic on it and it ate the attack. I'm going to have to max revive somebody. I don't know. I'm getting cooked, chat. I'm getting cooked. I need one more attack. Okay, that's fine. Let's just keep spamming try attack. We know that we know it. We know it's it does that good damage. And once I get the terror. Should live this way. It's not any boost. It did half to us last time. Yikes. Okay. We might have to bring the old squad back for this chat. Or level 100.
Okay, so we're gonna break our terror astralization here. Okay. Yeah, bug doesn't resist psychic. I don't know what I don't know what typing it was. Karen, please. Karen, please help me. I'm gonna fucking die. Karen, please? If there's anything you could do right Come on! Come on, Karen, please! Zeiss! I nodded at him. He's back! He's back! Yeah, it's the high grapple too. Here we go, here we go, here we go. This is what we want, this is what we want. Alright, buddy, I'm gonna need you to hit him with that with that fickle beam. Uh water. Right, it's easy, right? It's gotta be water. Use your grass moves, dude. You've got grass moves. You I know you got I know you got something, bro. Can I change moves? Crap. I'm pretty sure. Who have I got? Alright, I'm gonna do myself a solid. I'm bringing back Reuniclus. So that I can revive more Pokemon. And I can also change my attack to Thunderbolt, man. I live on one. That's crazy. Yes, sir! That was pretty, pretty sad. I lived on one naturally, which is actually pretty crazy. All right, let's, let's, let's try attack it. Okay. I grapple is tanking the hits like it's nothing. Okay, so it's water. Why don't we give? Let's give. Let's give. Uh, let's give Electivire a run. Yeah, I'll come in and thunder punch it. It's speed's reduced. I have the uh, expert belt. That's my boy. Nice. It's that. Yes, war. Dragon chair. Is it, wait, does that work for me? Oh, it does. It actually makes you pump. I didn't think that was gonna. Oh shit! Yes, I keep forgetting it's got earth power. I ain't gonna lie, I keep forgetting that it's got Earth power. <laughs> <laughs> he really dragon chained for me to perish! Oh no, that's embarrassing. Oh no. Okay, uh, let's go back. Okay, 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 okay. Think about it, think about it, think about it. Uh, where's my max revives? The most, the Pokemon's been doing the most damage is Porygon. I could do Kingdra too. I understand you're trying to support right now, bro, but I am not doing anything. I am not. Jeez. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I think I might be able to loop this, guys. I have an idea. If if his sweet syrupy syrupy son of a bitch has made this thing slow as anything, then sh oh wow, that did nothing to me. Wait, I can grass knot this thing. I have grass knot, right? We gave myself grass knot. Oh, hit him with it, bro. He oh, he's going all out! Yes! Nice, okay. This Hydrapple's dead, that's fine. Bring in another one, buddy. Bring in another guy. Here comes Dragonite. Yo. That's what I like to see. I got the plus one crit buff. I got the plus one crit buff. Give it to me. Give me that crit side chick. Dragonite used Thunder and Mist. No, Dragonite.
Oh no, there's that crit. Dragon Trier coming in. I'm gonna reduce the special defense. He's getting tired, I think. Looks like I can't absorb any more energy or put another barrier. It's time to attack. Time to end this, you two. Get my position permission to go all out. All right, just another psychic and a thunder, and we're we're, <laughs> we're done. All of the day's work. Surely it's not gonna murder both of us now. Yeah, I was gonna say I, I, I had a funny feeling it was me. You missed thunder twice. No, no way. Is it enough? The special defense drop. Enough, Kieran. Kieran, I need you to land this thunder for the boys, please. Please land the thunder. That works too. That works too. We'd love to see it. He came through, baby. Maybe it'll go inside a ball now. All right. I know I can you, Luke. You got this. What ball do we go for, chat? Which ball? Which ball? Which ball? I'm thinking dive. Oh, the beast ball. Yeah. I think we got to put it in a beast ball, right? Beast ball's like the best one. I, I, yeah, I'm in a beast ball. I like, I like the idea of beast ball in it. I had a beast in hand. Got him. Bam, bada bam. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo -doo. Is it over? The floor's cracked and all sorts of stuff. Is everyone okay? We're fine, don't worry. Oh, thank goodness, what a relief. I let my obsession lead you into a very dangerous situation. It's simply inexcusable. I'm so sorry, everyone. You should be! You completely fixate on this terrestrial stuff. You gotta keep your obsessiveness in check. Yeah, yes, you're absolutely right. Oh, I messed up too. I looked up for Lu uh, to Luki for so long. I wanted to be like him so, so badly. I didn't know what else to do. But I guess I just don't have it in me to be like him after all. Oh, finally, I can let go. You were really cool too, bro. What? Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh, uh, let it all out, buddy. Let it all out. I swear, I got such a silly younger brother. You can finally let it go. <laughs> oh, you two must have been so scared, but you showed brilliantly just now. You were truly dazzling. And in the end, our Luki even managed to catch Trapagos. So I think we consider our little expedition to Area Zero good and finished. Time to head back to Blueberry Academy. No, there's got to be a plot twist. Nah, there's got to be like a crack in the floor, fall through. Come on, something's happening. What's happening? Oh, okay. Whew, finally home. Need to get in touch with Geet and no scratch that. I need a publisher first. Hey, Lukey. Look, I know I caused a lot of trouble for the League Club and everyone. I wanted to give everyone a proper apology. Including you. So I'm sorry. But I, I, I guess what I'm trying to say is... I want to make things right. So do you think... We can start over from zero and be friends again. <laughs> this is copyright? Ah, oh, that's cringe. We're gonna leave you two behind if you don't hurry up. It's so cute. 
is very cute. Is it Ed Sheeran again? <laughs> I can hear it. What is it? I don't know what it is yet. I can't tell who it is. Oh, uh, it's, it's Ed Sheeran again. It's Ed Sheeran again. So, what is the... I... I'm not gonna lie. I love these games. But I think we may have overhyped it. It's Celestial, yeah. I kind of wanted there to be more with the Terrapagos and Dream whole theory thing where, like, we might see Sada and Toro again. There is some still post-DLC content, right? I want to go to the Crystal Lake. I feel like there's obviously still more to it. I'm just wondering. Y you guys are going to have to let me know. We rode the hype train. I just hope that, that if we go to that crystal lake, we have to go to that crystal lake. I have to know what's, what that's all about. That's not to say I didn't enjoy it, because I definitely did. But I feel like there should have been more to the Tara to, to the Tarapago stuff, right? Yeah, but we're going to go to the lake amaz immediately. We'll go class 3-2 to get the flying, and then we're going to go to the lake, yeah. That's what we're going to do. Wow. I wish we could get past this real fast. Okay, the shiny spot over there, yeah. Also, yeah, the other Paradox Park, we haven't seen Entei, or the, um... What was it, the other one? Terrakion. Yeah, I don't know how Stellar Type works either, they haven't explained it or anything, you know? My favorite part of the DLC, uh... I don't know, I, I, I... I already have a favorite part, I enjoyed all of it. I very much enjoyed all of it. I think that, like, we thought that more was going to happen. So we were expecting more. That's why I always set my expectations low for stuff like this. Because I was, like, fully on board with the whole theory of Terrapagos. There was, like, a Japanese football tale about the about a turtle that takes you to a separate, like, realm and stuff like that. And I was like, oh, my God, imagine if we go um, into, like, another realm or dimension, uh, depending on which game you're playing, where it takes you into the future and shows you where you're catching Pokemon from, or you get to meet Heath and stuff like that, you know? So. We do have the side mission with... What's her face? Um, the Hisui girl, right? So we have the, we have, we have that, and then we have the lake. Perrin, that's it. We have Perrin, then we've got the, uh, the lake. I definitely want to go see the lake immediately. We'll go get flying first. That's a remix by Toby Fox. That's cool. Yeah, getting the deck sword is going to take a little bit of time. I'll probably do that on my own time. So that's probably something I'll, I'll have to experience by myself. But I'll bring Terra Pagos. Yes, yes, yes. I heard you. I see you guys. All right. Oh, Terra- Oh, Stellar type seems to work. Oh, it's super fed against Terra Pokemon? Oh. 
Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's so good. Yes. Oh, I like that a lot. That's good. That's cool. This announcement for the following student, Luke, uh, from the Uber Academy. Prior, would like to see you in Classroom 1.4. Just an important news to share with you regarding the Trassel phenomenon. Okay. He's got Stella. Let's look more the way over here. Right. Let's go tie up some of these loose ends real fast. So let's go to him. Yes. Hello. Lukey. You have my uh, thanks for all you have done to help the league club, then help Kieran. Once you become champion, Kieran withdrew yourself from the ranking system, from our ranking system. Though I, I consider this somewhat sad, it's not as if he and I can no longer meet. More than anything, I'm glad he seems to be acting more like his former self. Indeed, I have been swept up in joy to such an extent I prepared a tremendous amount of flight enabling supplement used in my trial. Please feed your I guess the appropriate portion of it whenever you wish to fly. Big boy. Here, take this. Eat it. Eat it. Just keep eating it. Eat it forever. Oh, just permanently eat. Nice. I'm right on. We're able to fly now. <laughs> You'll see me at is powered up somehow. From the book looks of it, I would guess that he has gained the power to fly whenever you wish to. Well, I suppose that is an acceptable outcome. As it happens, there is a super hard course for my flying time trial. You may attempt it in clearing the course. Feel free to do so when you're ready. Melody can now fly through the air if you keep the ho uh, if you press the left stick while gliding. The rider will keep moving forward automatically while it's flying. If you press the left stick again, it will go back to gliding. Got it. Left me to go. So long. Okay. Right. So we got the ability to fly. That's what we wanted. So let's get the uh, controls fixed on that real fast. Is there like a Controls while flying should be inverted. Yes. That's what we want. Too used to my bloody Lilac Wars days. Right, okay, so let's go speak to Miss Briar and find out about this terrestrial stuff. Hey, Luke, glad to see you. You're feeling rested and recovered after our big adventure down the under depths? Yes, ma'am. Oh, youth is an enviable thing. I'm still feeling all wrung out despite having been back for a while now. But on to why I called you here. Since our return, I've been writing up everything we discovered on our expedition. Honestly, I hardly slept. I obtained Geet permission to turn all, uh, all into a book, but don't worry. I made sure to skip a few details and omit the names of those involved. So voila, a proof copy of the book, freshly delivered from my publisher just to you. Brian's book. Oh. A proof copy of the exploration is covering the area zero under depths. It's filled with long paragraphs describing what happened, along with Briar's thoughts. I behaved recklessly in the under depths. I don't know what I would have done if it weren't for you. You truly deserve a copy of this book. I just hope it's sufficient as an apology. Oh, and there's something else I need to check with you. Would you mind showing me your terror orb? Mm, so as much as behaving just like Kieran and Carmine's orbs. I believe it's because your orbs were directly exposed to the energy from Trapagos. Kieran and Carmine say they have ever since that the under de uh, the under depths, they've been able to terrestrialize their Pokemon without charging their terror orbs. Oh. Actually, there's one more piece of news I would like to share with you relating to the deepest depths. You know the terrarium called that hangs from the ceiling of the terrarium? Well, until now, I've been keeping it topped up with a mixture of Paldean soil and water from the crystal pool in Kitakami. That's how I've been able to stabilize the terrestrial phenomenon on our academy grounds. But the other day, I tried adding crystals I collect from the under, under depths of that mix, and it caused the properties of the core to change. The result? Pokemon shining in rainbow colors have started appearing all over the terrarium. Shining in rainbow colors. And they have the stellar terror type. Thanks to this, my research of the terrestrial phenomenon is shining brighter than ever. Stellar type. Terrestrialization grants a boost to moves, but only once per move type. After you use a move, no other moves of the same type, no other moves of that same type will get the boost. In terror ray battles, all moves will be boosted without limit. 
He has a boost to, to moves, but only once per move type. So you have to change typing. Is that why the... I get it. So like, you know what I mean? When I was looking at the ring spinning around, they were graying out typings. So you can do it for one of every single typing. Obviously, you don't have that many moves. You only have four moves, right? I wonder what happens if you use metronome. Maybe you could use all the... You could gray out all of the typings if you were just lucky enough to roll every single typing from metronome. Oh, there's one last thing. A man in a blue suit was, was coming over... Um, man in the blue suit was looking for you over by the entrance of the academy. A blue suit? I thought she were evil, bro. Hang on, lie. I thought she was the evilest. Wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, this this guy, right? Oh, here, it's, a, it's not a blue suit, is it? There you are, Luke. It's the person I was looking for. I heard the news. You're a new BB League champion. Am I right? I'll admit it. I'm blown away. Inviting you to this academy was the best decision I've made recently. So now that you've had some time to get comfortable here, how do you find the Blueberry Academy? Are you having fun? Yep. Good, good. Just what I like to hear. Anyways, there's one thing I'd like to ask you, Luke. You see, the whole academy has become so much more lively and energetic since you've came here. And uh, that got me thinking. Maybe we should have even more people come visit from Padea. Uh, have them... Oh, this is where the gym leaders come in. That's right. Yes. Leave it to me. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. You can use the club room computer to contact anyone you want to invite. It'll cost BP, but we'll pay for their trip and such. Here's what gets you started. Thousand. Two hundred. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I think uh, I'll arrange a special coach to stay in the club room while they're uh, not teaching. You should have a chat with them while they're here. Now then, I'll leave it to you. Enjoy. Okay. So I can call the gym leaders and stuff like that over. Got it. Right. Use the piece in the league room. You can invite your friends and acquaintances from Powder Aries and visit the Booby Academy, a special coach you can talk uh, to and battle with. You can have a max of two visitors over at a time. Okay. Nice. God, there's so much post game stuff. Is that the blue suit guy? Was that the blue suit trap? That was it, right? Entrance blue suit? Oh, all right. I'll go back. I'll go back there after we've done this. It's the real one! It's the real one, right? It's the curious development. How have I broken through the boundaries of space-time? And who are you? Yeah, this isn't the robot. This is the real one, right? Have we met? I'm sorry, but I don't seem to recall it. I'm Professor Toro. I researched at Pokemon Area Zero, and yet... What? Oh, this Pokemon. Is this I Iron Serpent? That right, so his name is Maridon. Hmm, that's a good name. The clues you've already let slip, I suppose I would have to conclude. From my perspective, this must be the future. Though, of course, the complexities of space time are. It's possible that our encounter might not even be occurring in a timeline connected to my own. Perhaps this meeting is nothing more than a fleeting miracle. Why don't we exchange as much useful data as we can with what little time, time that the fate has gifted us?
Is there anything you'd like to ask me? Why are you here? I don't promise to know the cause. I was analyzing some recent data in my secret lab one moment, and the next I was standing here before you. So when we read the book, and him talking about- Oh, I'm gonna give him the white book! I'm gonna give it to him! The paradox! Perhaps it's the influence of the crystal Pokemon that lies dominant in that space. Or perhaps the, uh, the law- the, the, the- Wait, the cause lies with you and I. Is there anything else you'd like to ask me? What are you studying now? I'm researching methods to catch Pokemon that live in different timelines, so I might transport them to present day in my own timeline. It sounds fantastical, no doubt, but I'm drafting plans now for a mission that may achieve it. You see, this book captured my imagination when I read it as a child and has never let go. The progress has been slow and beset by failures. I haven't left the lab in quite some time now. I desperately hope that I might glean some new insight from this conversation, so I finally make some progress and return home. Is there anything else you'd like to ask me? What about your family? Oh, you've much to know about my private life. I do have a family, a son. He's probably at home right now. Well, no, I suppose right now could be inaccurate. Whenever and wherever he is, I'm imagining he must be quite lonely. Now, let us trade places in this exchange. I'd say it's time to uh, come for me to ask my own questions. What is this place? It doesn't appear to be anywhere in Paldea. It's not a kid of Kami. So in the Cat of Kami's Crystal Pool, huh? I remember reading about it in certain texts. It's said to be a place where water wells up from the ground and with terrestrial energy. It would seem to be shifted, uh, that I've been shifted quite far in both space and time. The next question then. The Pokemon you have, the Iron Serpent. I, I mean, Maridon. Tell me more about it. Did you really? Then I wonder whence it came and how it appeared, uh, uh, it happened to arrive at that beach. There appears you don't know much about that creature's exact origins yourself. Hmm, that book you have there, I don't recognize its cover. What is it? The hidden treasure of Area Zero. Would, would you let me see it for just a moment? I knew it. The white, t the white book. Descriptions of the Area Zero underdepths and, and a record of Terrapagos' awakening. Who is this bride to have written such work? I should have said she did send in the heath. I should have said it. I should have said it. I should have said it. A school teacher plumbing the depths of Area Zero. Access is supposed to be limited to myself and certain members of the Pokemon League. At any rate, that, uh, that is a book that would ignite the imagination of any true scientist. I'm sorry, but I simply must have a have the time to read through this book more thoroughly. Ah, oh, the mist is closing once again. I assume this means our time is near its end. Oh, he's sad. I wish I could spend longer getting to know the Iron Serpent, but I must hurry. The book, I imagine it must be quite valuable. It wouldn't feel right to claim it without offering you any recomp recompense. And exchange then, though I hate to part with something so precious to me, would you consider trading me that book for a, my copy of the Violet book? Absolutely. Wait, his book is the key to opening the the time machine? No? His book does something with the time machine. I swear it does. I bid you adieu. Wait, 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 wait. Am I crazy? His book does something. His book specifically does something to the time machine. His one specifically is the key. Wait, 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 wait. Did I just break the time? Wait, what just happened? Wait, what, what the fuck just happened? Did I- Did I just fuck with the time loop? Wait, if I- wait, 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 if we took his book, when the time machine was never made! Wait! Wait a minute! No, wait, I'm confused! Wait, this is fucking with me! My brain, I'm melting right now, I'm melting. Wait, I'm confused. I'm, I'm losing my mind. Wait, where- it said I could talk- wait, hold on. If we took the book! Wait, I'm lost. What the fuck just happened? Bro, what just happened? I'm lost. Whoa, 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 
whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. We're in the entrance hall. No one's in the cafeteria. Is that classes? Wait. I, I did all the classes, right? Oh, revisit. No, fuck that noise. I feel like I should. I feel like I should have said no. Wait, where is everybody? Oh wait. Nah. Oh my god, look at these guys. Me go find Arvin. Where's Arvin, chat? He mentioned it. I guess this time, look, uh, first time looking at us with our uniforms on. This is so funny. I think we just rewrote history or some shit. If we take the book from him in the future for, and he give it to me. Oh. Potato Style is the five gifted. Potato Style is a great name. Ongoing Sitch. What's going on? What's going on? Guys, I just entered a time loop and I'm losing my fucking mind. Got a little proposal for you. How would you like to be a tutor? One step at a time. Yeah, come on. What's going on? You're right, right you are. Okay. The other team star boss having a rough time of it. Nelly Otty Atticus, yeah. You might actually be able to repeat the year, which makes suck out the effort they put in to come back to school. Before you ask me, me and Ariel already tried to have tutoring ourselves. Yep. So they need to learn a test. Yep, sure. The opinion grades are pretty decent. Yep. Lucy's back, yeah, sure, I can help at some point. Yeah, I will definitely help. That's what we forgot, we gotta get this under wraps, no telling Penny. Yeah, we should have tried enough for one lifetime. Let's be our little secret. Yeah, 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 let us know when you're ready to start. Sure. Bro, I'm fucking losing my mind. So, wait, 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 because isn't the Violet book normally, by default, it's over... Oh my god, there's two... Hey, yeah, I have to go back. I'm gonna go back to Area Zero. Arvin, Arvin, talk to me right now, bro. What's going on? Go to that portal. Let me show this, buddy. Yes, I definitely borrowed it, bro. I'm, I am fucking losing it. I took the book and the game reset. I'm- my brain is melting out of my ears. I should've said no. I wanna know what it said when he said no. I need to go back to the pool, we need to- I also just need to go down. Oh my god. No! That, we know that there's multiple copies of the book, but wasn't it specifically Toro's copy of the book? It was specifically Toro's copy of the book that unlocked the time machine. And I might be thinking too much into this, but I have to go down there and find out. Because it was the key to, like, you, like, you take the book out or you put the book into the time machine. In the story, he'd have more than one, though. Wait, I am fu- <gasps> Yo, I forgot I could fly now. Yo, this is Gamer. Yeah, my brain hurts too, but I'm actually like kind of losing my mind over it. I took the book and the game reset. Oh, yeah, I created a paradox. Yes. I'm not gonna lie, this is amazing that I can just fly around like this now.
That's why I want. I want. I want to know. I want to know what it said. If we said no, I should have said no. And it's still open. Ow. Put me in there. Just a second. Just a second. It's just going to take it straight down, isn't it? So... Uh, so, like... It Wait. No, you can't, you can't get back to the time machine room. We can't go back there now. Dude. So wait. I just had to run an alt account, and before the crystal pool, the start screen is daytime. Afterwards, it's evening. The sun is setting on the SV story. Oh, okay, that's cute. Oh, you should try to take the indigo disc out. That's right, that's, that disc is still in there, right? No, you can't even interact with it. Oh, dude. Dude, what the hell is happening? I, I found Arvin. I spoke to Arvin. Arvin didn't have anything crazy to say to me. Man, there's nothing else here. Lighthouse? We try the lighthouse. That was the weirdest thing I saw. I honestly feel like I was... I... That was insane. The second I got the book and he got sent back, the game reset. Oh my god. They just re reconsider if you say no? Okay. Oh my fucking god. It was in front of us the entire time. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, dude. I don't know. Right. Listen, I my brain melted, man. So what just happened is we spoke to real Professor Turo. He wanted Briar's book. So we gave him Briar's book in exchange. Bro, there's something this surely surely we can use this for something what do you mean take both violet books we can't take both violet books you can't you can't take the one off the wall well, I don't even know where Briar is where is Briar right now where even is she Oh, bro. That book does open up the time machine, but we can't we can't go back to the time machine anymore. It doesn't let you. Where was she? Where was she a minute ago? Was she in? Oh, 
Oh, we need to talk to the guy in the blue suit chat. Let's do that real fast. Hold on. Oh, I can't fly. I'm indoors. I'm stupid. Oh, my God. That's insane. Yeah, she's in the other school. That's right. That's right. We need to go see her. I need to go see her. I can't believe that happened. Like, I feel like it was a, it was like a fever dream. Like, if it, 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 one second we were in the game, and the next I can kicked out to the fucking main menu. Wow. Oh. This guy. He's the guy that gives us all the, um, gets you the access to legendary Pokemon. Okay. Yeah. You know, Kyogre, I feel right at that one. Not only mill Pokemon. I was uh, only at the Adventures of Power Day when I spot these odd rocks on the scene. I thought to myself, that's snacks worth. These gotta be those famous rocks except to bring riches. So I figured I might as well squeeze my eyes at real time and make a wish on them. After a few seconds, I opened my eyes and what should appear in front of those rocks but a Kyogre. Just that big blue brazen as you please. Now that, uh, that was a shocking day, no mistake. It loves the snack you have there. Okay. Right, okay, so we can talk to that guy. He gives us... Okay, okay. So, question of the day is... Can we go to Briar? She was in... Was she in 1-4? I don't think she's here, guys. I think briar has gone. Yeah, I'm it's I'm I'm confused, bro. I am so confused. That was crazy. That I they honestly that that's made it for me. Just just that feeling. Just that feeling of like not understanding what the hell just happened and like realizing that if we take the book from him in the past, it did something to time and Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's very cool. Well, I think I'm going to wrap up here, guys. Uh, I can actually sleep on a regular time <laughs> today, finally. Uh, I appreciate you guys hanging out. It was a great uh, DLC. I enjoyed it thoroughly. Uh, wait, where? Question. Is that. What's the fourth? Where's Doku? Is there a Doku Taro? Is that a thing? How do you get Doku Taro? Is that, is that the parent quest? I don't have all of the Pokemon in my Pokedex. Okay. Right. Okay. That's what that is. That's all I needed to know. I think that's... Also, yeah. Where's Raging Bolt? Where's the other guys? Is it just in Area Zero? It's an event later. Parent side quest? Yeah, okay, parent side quest. Is it the same with like the Terrakion as well? Is there a Terrakion and Entei? We're gonna have to do all of this stuff. Parent is the extra Paradox Mon, need to finish the decks. Okay. Mythical event not out yet. There is a there is a mythical event for it. Okay. So then, how do we get Paradox Ente? Is that is that a parent? Is it all the all the Paradox Pokemon is a parent side quest? So we got to do. All I got to do is complete the tech, the Pokedex, and then we can do the parent events. Okay. Okay. 
The mythical event has like a whole hour long storyline. Wait, how do we know about this? Two hundred Pokemon. So that wait, so the Doku Taro is a mythical event that's not out yet. It's been data mined. Right. Okay. So there's going to be an extra. Okay. 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 The event was data mined. Right. Okay. So there's going to be a little extra thing they drop in a. Okay. Okie dokie. Right. Okay. So we have that to look forward to, and I got to do Perrin's event. So what I've got to do then is I need to work on, in the meantime, I might, I might stream beating the decks. I think we will probably end up streaming uh, doing the decks for this area over whatever time. And then we've got to do, okay, okay. Okie dokie. All right, cool. Well, again, thank you guys so much for hanging out. I do appreciate you all that gifted members and hung out on the stream. I do appreciate you all. Um, we will see you guys in the next one. All right, be safe. Take it easy. Peace, peace. Bye-bye.